Well, well, well. Good Saturday to you, my friends. Good Saturday to you. We're going to finish Sapienza. We're going to do it. Maybe. The only reason we might not finish Sapienza is... Patient Zero, right? You should complete the source before accessing this content. Which I probably should. But. We'll see. Maybe I won't complete the source before accessing this content. Maybe. I don't give a damn. We'll find out. Barbecue season. The bane of my existence. Let's give ourselves a promotion. Let's um, get this final assassination out of the way. We have to assassinate him using the barbecue fireplace. Even though it doesn't say you have to use the barbecue one. Hey, Rifi. Even though it doesn't say you have to use the barbecue one. You do. Which is a little bit annoying. Wasted about three hours of my time yesterday. But was it a waste? Yes, yes it was. So... <clears throat> we're not allowed to get seen. And we need some propane. You're also trying to 100% complete Sapienza so you can complete it before me. Well, you probably will do, man. You probably will do. <clears throat> I doubt you're doing it on Master. If you are, then kudos to you. Plus, you probably just know the game better than I do. But we shall see. <clears throat> I have faith that you will do it before me. So we need to get up there. And then I think, you know... It's... Eminently possible that uh, he just walks up to it. Which means we just need to get to the roof without getting spotted. Nice try, game. Nice try. <laughs> On the roof again. <laughs> I can't wait to be on the roof again. On the roof again. You're not doing it on casual because it's too easy. Yeah, totally. Are you trying to get a silent assassin each playthrough? Ooh, that will be tricky then. Well, maybe. It'll be interesting. Now I think we just wait. And I think he just comes here. I can't wait to be on the roof again. Patience is the key. The challenge I'm doing right now will be tricky. Yeah, it's super annoying. I think we just have to wait. I actually think we just have to wait. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <clears throat> 
He's gonna go in there. And then he's gonna come to the barbecue, I believe. Come on. Oh, thank you very much. <laughs> Talent assassinating this one will definitely be difficult. Target down. Next up, Francesca DeSantis. Oh, thank God. Right, that's all the assassinations done. <laughs> now. Discover Sapienza. We're missing six places. Unleash the Kraken. Find and destroy six crocodiles. Pacify them both with cannabis. Pacify them with cannabis is easy enough. <clears throat> this is impossible. Just look for a combination code like this. Right. <clears throat> six crocodiles, huh? We should probably leave the mansion for now. Luigi's mansion. Got it. <clears throat> yeah, I didn't want to assassin all these, but trying to do them on master is enough for me. <clears throat> Because it means, <clears throat> if you do just try and YOLO your way through it, it's still a challenge. And if you want to steal uniforms, you're not allowed to just kill people to steal them. But there's no way I'm assassinating every challenge. It's too much for me. <laughs> well, I might have been killing these guys for the sake of habit, <clears throat> I guess. Dee -dee 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 -dee. I just want to leave. It's probably steal one of their uniforms. <laughs> I can do this all day. Right. Let's get a uniform. Well, actually, I don't need a uniform. I'm a chef. What am I talking about? Let's leave, let's go crocodile hunting. Crocodile shoes. Crocodile shoes. Do 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 do. Da da da. And we'll uh, try and get the cannabis and uh, give him the old poison -a -roo. It's not really poison. 
knocks him out, which is a bit weird. It must be real strong stuff. <laughs> oh, crocodillos! Look! Help, Look! Please. I'm just hunting crocodiles! Don't be such bitches about it! These whiny bastards! No! Whoa! <clears throat> Am I only 100% completing the Season 1 missions? Uh, I don't know what that means, but I'm completing the whole thing. I guess I maybe do know what that means. Um, Right, let's bring our sniper rifle. We're completing everything. Everything that's possible for us 100%, we are 100%. That's the dealio. That's the plan. Hey, Zeron. Paris to Hokkaido. Alright, no, no, no. We're doing a... Everything. Is there a safe house in the clock tower? No, but it was in the sewer. Uh... There isn't a confessional booth. Oh, it's only a small one. Yeah, F that. Yeah, that's fine. <clears throat> we'll get our sniper uni and uh clean house a bit. H R U, is that how are you? Or is it just Haru? If it's how are you, then I'm great. If it's Haru, then uh Haru to you too, Zeron. Ah, oh, I came up too far. I wish I had a silenced sniper rifle, but we'll get one eventually. We'll get one eventually. We've also got a bunch of sniper challenges to do. <clears throat> I don't think we can do them, though. Most of them. Maybe. Possibly. I don't know. Kill them both with one shot, we could probably do if we did the, th the therapy thing. Yes, I'm trespassing. Get over it. Sure do love not having to worry about being silent anymore. It's a real weight off my shoulders. Now, before we start sniping, let's prep the area.
<laughs> you ain't calling for help. Oh my god! <laughs> Someone will come up here to investigate eventually. Maybe. I just don't want them coming up when we're sniping, so I'm gonna kill everyone with an airshot, basically. What the hell was that guy KO? No, maybe, possibly. Did he just wake someone up? You know where he is. Go get him. Come on, buddy. Go get me. That'll get me some more ammo. God damn it. Excited for CP2077. Oh, Cyberpunk. Um, no. I'm going to play it. I wouldn't say I'm excited for it. I am ambivalent about it. <clears throat> Loath to be excited for any hyped game these days. But hopefully it's good. <clears throat> I hope it's good, but I have no expectations that it will be good. <clears throat> Starting off the day with a little bit of murder. It's an integral part of the plan. Are you 
Yoink! <clears throat> right, I think I've mostly cleared this place out, apart from this one guy. Right. That's going to allow us to hunt for crocodiles relatively safely. And we can also do that unleash the Kraken one. It's a little bit awkward from what I remember. You have to do something in a certain order. It gives you no clues as to what the order is, I believe. <clears throat> Two. Six of them. Right. Let's do Unleash the Kraken. Now for this one, you see these boats? Is it these boats? No, it's one of these boats. One of these boats. boat is it? One of these boats has got this one. It's got the bells on it. You have to shoot the bells in a certain order. It's got what? Four bells? One, two, three, four. You have to shoot them in a certain order. I don't know what the order is. I'm not gonna... Let's see, we've got four, so there's what? Sixteen possibilities? Maybe less. So I'm just going to Google the order. They shouldn't make such esoteric challenges. Where there's literally no way you could figure it out from within the game. Is one of the missions you've taken out a ruthless dictator of a Middle Eastern nation? One of the Hitman missions. Um, good question. Probably. You lucky bitch. Uh 
<laughs> Does anyone know? Hey, Coco! Good to see you, man. I need to know the order of shooting these goddamn bells. Let's just Google it. There's no way of figuring it out. It's just random. <clears throat> Left, right, top, middle. Not cheating, man. There's literally no way to figure it out. They shouldn't do stupid redacted challenges that there's no clues in game as to how to do them. Well, you just have to randomly guess until you get it right. The only way you can figure this challenge out is by googling it. It's literally the only way. Just spent five hours guessing the combination. But you need to Google it even to know that there was a combination. You know? It's just called Unleash the Kraken, and there's nothing that implies that. You'd have to do that. It's just like, get this Unleash the Kraken challenge, good luck. You need to know to go up here with a sniper rifle, find the ship with bells on it, Snipe the bells in a particular order with zero clues. Madness. But you know what? We've done it. Multiple streams trying to unleash the Kraken. <laughs> Absolutely not. That would drive me to insanity even more than I already am. <clears throat> dee -dee -dee, dee -dee -dee. You guess I'm not a real Hitman fan then. <laughs> totally. I don't think anyone in the world has completed that challenge without googling it. I'm willing to make that claim. Right, we're looking for crocodiles. Crocodillos. People who did it first... ...were the people who made the game. They had insider knowledge. Hello, sir. Welcome. No, I think they did. One second. Uno Memento.
You're gonna be fine, okay? Shit! This is messed up. God damn it, here I am trying to write a text message. When I play Hitman, if the game is free to play, but every 10 minutes a microtransaction pack would pop up. No, absolutely not. Right, let me write my text message in peace. Okay, right. Crocodile hunt. If I was a crocodile, where would I be? I think there's one in the sewers. There's two on the beach. I think there's probably one on the pier. Hello. Yo, yo. Oh, no. Please don't. That's for looking at me funny. Um, I reckon there's going to be one on this pier for sure. What up, bodyguards? Oh, crocodillos! Please be one here. Please. No? Hmm. Hmm. One in the sewer. I think there's one in the base. Crocodillos, also. I need your outfit. There might be one over here, you know? There's our sewer one. Right, two more. I think there's one in one of these stairwells somewhere. I've got a terrible memory for things that I haven't been paying attention to, but I think I maybe possibly, potentially, saw one in a stairwell somewhere. Maybe. Oh, 
Ah! I didn't see that one, but I'm glad we just found it. Right, there's one more somewhere. I think it's in the base. <clears throat> Where could the last one be? Ooh, a pottery place. I don't think I've ever been in here. That crazy octopus, that's well sweet. Don't, what the hell are you doing? don't worry about it. Are you out of your mind? Um there. Am I out of my mind? What? Maybe. Pacify the shit! One more, one more, where could it be? Oh El Crocodillo. Crocodile, where would I be? In a house? In somewhere? Part of me says it's on a roof. I can feel it in my bones. It's on a roof somewhere. A murderer? I don't believe it. Where would an inflatable crocodile be? Hello, Manuel. Cato. We're looking for an inflatable crocodile. I'm gonna bring you down. <clears throat> How do I do? Very good, thank you. Very good. How do you do? I think there's one in that base somewhere. I firmly believe there's one in that base somewhere. I need help, Dad. Something happened? I think probably. Crocodillo. Maybe the stoner guy's got one. What do I have against inflatable crocodiles? Um, what does the game have against them? It's the game that's asking me to kill them. I've got no beef with them at all, but if the game tells me to do something, I'm going to do it.
That's not going to work. Please unlock this door. Thanks, man. Jesus Christ, he can fly. <laughs> I will never forget you, Brian. El Patino. I'm not dressed like a black and white clown, it's more black and blue, right? Black and silvery blue? No, white and silvery blue. Mm, maybe grey. Maybe it is black, maybe it's the lighting. That's slander, and I don't appreciate it. I'm not a serial killer. Serial killers are subtle. You said target spotted. I'm more of a mass shooter than a serial killer. You know? Thank you. We need that. <clears throat> Does this guy have a crocodile? No. Why am I so pro? Because <clears throat> many years ago, I was exploring in the wilderness of Siberia. And I found a cave, and inside the cave, I found a magic lamp, and I rubbed the lamp, and a genie came out, and he offered me three wishes. But I'm not greedy, so I just took one, and uh, I wished to be incredibly pro at Hitman, which was odd, because the game wasn't out at the time, so the genie was a bit confused, but... He said, okay. And uh, here we are. Some would argue it's a waste of a wish, but whatever. It's no big deal. And then I crushed the magic lamp and the genie within it, because nobody deserves that kind of power. <clears throat> Can't believe I used a genie to cheat a hitman. Is it cheating? I don't think it's cheating. I'm just using performance enhancing wishes. Why didn't I wish for universal domination? Too much effort. Command, this is Red Leader. We've got Dominating the universe sounds well and good. But you just know that if you're dominating the universe, someone else is going to see to that throne and be like, I could take that off him and I could dominate the universe. You know? Tomorrow am I going to stream or not? Now there's an excellent question, my friend. There is an excellent question. I do have some commitments tomorrow, but... I'll probably do a stream in the evening. But don't you worry, today we're doing a full-on 12-hour stream. Since I was asked, no. Yeah, that's the way it works. 
We're doing a long stream today. Oh yes. Longest stream in the West. 12 hours. Some guys being a nuisance to everyone. I love how they report our behavior. We're just a bit of a nuisance, you know. Bye, Manuel Cato. They've had to start getting the security guards from the science lab. That's when you know it's not going well for them. Oh, thank you very much. Alright guys, let's find this killer. <clears throat> he could be anywhere, and he could be anyone, so watch your back. Are you the killer? Are you the killer? Uh, can you please get out of my face? That sounds like exactly what a killer would say. <laughs> right. Get them both to smoke the weed. Meanwhile, keep an eye out for a crocodile. Later, Coco. Where, 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 where? <clears throat> where could the last crocodile be? If I was the last crocodile, where would I be? Somewhere incredibly annoying to find. That's where I'd be. Hmm. 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 I don't think it's going to be in the observatory. I think it's on one of these roofs. Something in my bones is telling me. I don't know why. Something in my bones is telling me that it's in this area. Even though it's not the most likely place for it. Maybe it's in the attic. Please don't crash. Please don't crash. It's fine because it keeps track of them, so we still only need to find that last one. But that is annoying. Hmm. That's what I get for leaving the game running for 24 hours. Sacribler. Sacribler. I hate it when it crashes, man. This game is ancient, it shouldn't crash.
Just because I leave it running for 24 hours at a time. That's no reason for it to crash. How many missions have I got left in Sapienza? Um, we've done 81 of 185, which sounds really bad, but it's actually not that bad because Sapienza's got multiple stories. We're doing World of Tomorrow, and then we've still got these three, and they've all got their own challenges, so it's actually not that bad. Uh, World of Tomorrow. This is what we've got left. <clears throat> so... Four discoveries, seven feats. The classics can't be completed. The sniper ones. Eliminate a target and dump the body in the ocean with one shot. So yeah, right. Let's start as I don't know. I sure wish I knew where that last um, alligator was. Let's start in the field lab. <clears throat> We're going to kill the virus and get it out of the way. some type of quarantine unit. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> Let's have a bit of fun. Processing. Sorry, guys. <clears throat> Well, okay. Never mind. Remember the first time I did that, they didn't turn it off. It's fine, though. I just want the scientist out there. You made it. The virus prototype will be close by. Look for some type of quarantine unit. Let's kill the virus. A virus. Time to die. Right. 
I'm compromised, but that's fine. Virus destroyed. Two targets remaining. Aruga. Aruga. All right. I did show that virus. So you get to be nosy scientists. What happened? Knock him out! Knock him out! There we go. This is the outfit I wanted. These guys can go basically anywhere. Right. <clears throat> Where could the last crocodile be? If I was the last crocodile, where would I be? I just don't know. I need to go get that cannabis joint. <sighs> where could the last crocodile be? It really is just a case of roam the map until you find it. What? Snitches get stitches. Let's not go that way. <clears throat> <laughs> Maybe it's a uh, like near our safe house. Oh, crocodilo! One odd fountain. Anyway. Maybe it's in here somewhere. Maybe we've got one in our safe house. I believe it with half my heart. No. I guess 47 is too serious. That requires a key card and a uniform. Luckily, it seems both are within reach. She says that just randomly. Luckily, it seems both are in reach when none of them are in reach. I guess we already have the keycard. In which case, why is she bringing it up? And we started in the ether lab, so she's just totally gone mental. Maybe this guy's got one. He seems like a wild, carefree kind of guy. Do you have a crocodile? No. I refuse to Google this last crocodile. I refuse. I need to channel the power of the genie. <clears throat> Where could it be?
Only it was in like a rational place. Maybe it is. But I can't find it anywhere. It should be down by the water, right? You would think. Logically. But it's not. Hmm. I already got this one. And then I got the one in the bathtub up here. I really thought there'd be one at the pier, you know? The pier seemed like a reasonable place for one. And you're supposed to keep me safe? Right. Wrong. <laughs> Will I be doing Hitman 2 after this? Yes, absolutely. Absolutely. And then Hitman 3 comes out two days after my birthday. Perfect. I'm never gonna find this crocodile. Maybe I should just accept that and move on with my life. Oh. <clears throat> right, I'm giving it five minutes. If I don't find this crocodile in five minutes, then I'm Googling it. I'm sorry, but I am. It's unreasonable to try and find a goddamn crocodile in the entire map. I do think it's in there somewhere. More security. Hmm. Very well. I really do feel like it's in here somewhere. I don't know what this guy would be doing with uh, an inflatable crocodile, but I'm pretty sure he has one. Hey, I, I found an old box of VHS tapes in the observatory. I didn't know Caruso was sold. Oh, those, they're all, uh... Probably by water. So that's what I thought as well, but then there was that one... Well, it was in a bathtub. What's this? Oh, it's just another way of opening the door. You would think it'd be by water, yeah. There was two on the beach. There was one in a bathtub. There was one in the sewer. And there was one... Somewhere else. And then... Yeah, I don't even know where the fifth one was. There was a dead rat in my home. Ah, good. What do you mean Hmm. 
<clears throat> I think it's time to Google. I've looked everywhere. What? Well, no, I obviously haven't looked everywhere, otherwise I'd have found it. But I've looked everywhere that I can conceive of. Look. Are you a real? Not in public. Have some decorum. Maybe in here. Any children in this map? No. You don't get children, I think, in this game. The stores are like the last vestige of possibilities. You'd think it'd be near the beach. I guess, have I checked? I don't think I've checked the boats. Which seems like an obvious place, but I don't think I've checked the boats. Over here. Stay safe out there, security man. Come on. Marina came by the bar last night, asking for Roberto. Uh, still pining over him? Really? I mean, I'm right here. <laughs> yeah, that's the problem. You're there. Mmm, there's a beach ball. No crocodile. Right, I've reached the end of my tether. I'm googling it. Inflatable crocodile. Sapienza. <clears throat> On the beach. Uh huh. In the tub. The sewer. Follow the coast until you get to the pier. The crocodile will be underneath it. So it was at the pier. <clears throat> underneath the pier. Underneath the pier? What? There is no underneath of the pier. Or was it an explosion or something? Nah, nothing like that. All you catch is Underneath the pier. Oh, there it is! What? Why didn't that get me it? What the Do I have to get them all? I might have to get them all. Okay. Dee 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 dee. Probably nothing. Huh. Security, huh? And if I see anything, rest assured, I will let you. Oh, Jesus Christ, he's on. Oh, man, I gotta get a suit. Look at that. 
I think I iced the guy who I need. Who's my favorite NPC? Uh... Oh, I shot this guy, right? Who's my favorite NPC? Good question, I can't remember the levels that well. Is there any other way into that building? Because I don't have a lockpick. How's someone going to get hurt by me throwing a coin down a wishing well? I mean, I guess he was right. Self-fulfilling prophecy. But, um, if he'd kept his mouth shut. I'm sure you don't have to do them in the same... Ah, let me in. Okay, I need a crowbar then. Awfully polite, man. It's probably okay, nothing to be worried about. Just please leave. Crowbar? Crowbar? No. Never easy. Crowbar. Crowbar, crowbar. No, I'm just stuck back in that area. Oh, <sighs> sacre bleu. The wrench. Maybe one day I'll find a crowbar. Security is tight. 
security is tight today. Get out of here, birds. There's usually crowbars all over the place. Well, is that true? There's usually at least one crowbar somewhere. That's accurate. I think there might be one in here. Wrench. Crowbar. That was a lot of work for a crowbar. How many have I shot now? Two on the beach, one below the pier, one in the sewer. We'll get this one in the bathtub. And then there's one more. Which is allegedly in a hallway somewhere. Which was my initial theory. This is the wrong frickin' house. I think it's safe to say I've lost my mind. I really thought that was the house, you know? I really thought that was the house. Aha! Yes! Oh, thank God. Right, no more crocodiles. What an ordeal that was. What a gosh darn ordeal that was. Right. <laughs> Let's go get the cannabis. El Cannabiso. El Marejuano. Huh. And then we just need to feed it to those guys. That will be another two challenges done. And we're well on our way. Well on our way. <laughs> that guy had it coming. Right. And this should be easy enough wearing this outfit, so I'm pretty sure we're allowed to go wherever we want in the base. <clears throat> pretty sure. We only have one smoke, but we can just save and then uh, give them it one at a time. That pothead never hurt anyone. You don't know that. That's one hell of an assumption. Maybe he did something terrible in his life that caused him to turn to drugs. Think about it. 
<clears throat> Maybe there's a reason he's so anti-war. To the point where he would make placards. Yeah, he turned to pot! <laughs> Totally. He didn't want to go too extreme. One down. Let's just wait for him to do bit up. Here he comes, maybe. That's right. Light it up. He doesn't notice that it's hand rolled, no? That guy seriously cannot take a hit. Weak. That's what he is. <laughs> right, now I just need to give her one, which should be equally as easy. As long as we're allowed upstairs. If we're not, then uh, someone's dying. Mm-hmm. We're not. Someone's dying. Oh yeah. What? What exactly did happen that night? Don't worry about what happened that night. He thought he saw a ghost, but he was just freaking out. Oh, that's. Who's compromised me? Don't worry about who I am. They'll get over it. This is impossible. Okay, look. I didn't realize I was that low on ammo. I'm sorry, guys. I didn't realize. Ugh. Whatever, they're never going to look in this corner. Copy. We have a dead body. 
They'll never look in this corner. Let's just chill out. And I will be back in a minute whilst they chill out. Dee 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 dee. Calm down, little guys. It's all going to be fine. Tony's running around naked. What? Usually they get dressed. Hey. There we go. He finally noticed. They go, hey, and then they notice that they're not wearing any clothes, and then they miraculously pull out a new set of clothes. <clears throat> right, now she's going to get high, because she got high, because she got high. Cause she got high. Da, da 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 And then His behavior is getting more and more erratic. In many ways. We must be getting real close to being done with the challenges. Um what's next? We've done all the assassinations. We still need to discover Sapienza. We've got six areas we haven't been to, apparently. Not sure where those are. Push a target into the wishing well. Push a target into the wishing well. Eliminate a target with a church bell. Luck alone is worthless. We need to throw, what, five coins in the fountain? I assume. Find and equip all the disguises. We haven't worn seven of the disguises. That one's interesting. Disguise yourself as a priest. Do not harm, pacify, or eliminate the priest, which means that there must be a priest outfit kicking around somewhere. For that one, we're going to have to cheese it. Hide DeSantis and the golf coach in the same closet. And that's it, apart from the <coughs> master sniper and plumber ones. Everyone seems to know he killed his mother. Like, it's the worst kept secret ever. Guy can't keep a secret to save his life. Look, stop talking about Roberto. Just go and have a smoke. I am well aware. It's quite to be expected. Caruso is not exactly used to the outcome of this. Believe me, everything is under control. Now, if you'll pardon me, there's something I need to investigate. <laughs> She's saying everything's under control, right? She's saying everything's under control. We've already destroyed the virus, and she has gone and seen that the virus is destroyed. Why is she saying everything's under control? Don't worry, everything's fine. 
I mean, some guy came in and put a bullet through the virus. But if you ignore that, everything's fine. Also, we've got a lot of dead guys. But if you ignore that as well, everything's fine. I'm just gonna have a smoke. Doing this for a reason. What the fuck? Son of a bitch! No, no. Oh, no. A very vital reason. Command area is. See little things like that where you shoot them when they're in the middle of talking to command should probably raise an alarm. Target down. Next up, Silvio Caruso. Next up is hiding her body in the same place as the golf guy. Hey, Bucky. <laughs> Don't mind me just taking out the trash. You should have watched earlier. No, it's fine, man. You missed me hunting for crocodiles, and you missed me... Um... Mostly the crocodile thing, to be honest. Anyway, we're going on the long haul today. 12 hour stream is the plan. <clears throat> right, we need a closet. It's not allowed to be a trunk, it's got to be a closet. Look, camera. Come on, man. What happens if it's 11.59 or 12.01? Well, it's actually going to be... Um, 11.55 at most, because that's when YouTube's archiving stops. A stream can only be archived for 11 hours 55 minutes. That's the limit. So it's not actually going to be 12 hours, it's going to be 11.55. Come on, man, why'd you have to do that? Liar. Yeah, I know, I know.
Is there a closet in here? No. Aha! Perfect. Now we just need the golf, dude. Dee 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 dee. Son of a bitch. Well, that makes things awkward. Should have choked him out. <sighs> Any normal person would reload and try again. Deserve a thousand viewers when you stream 12 hours straight. No, no, no. I deserve a thousand viewers once I'm competent enough for people to be interested in watching. <clears throat> this is the worst. This is actually the worst. I'm going to have to drag his body all the way up there. Or... No, I can't take her body back out the closet. This is the worst. Don't you make like five bucks for every thousand views? Uh, I don't have monetization turned on, so I make zero bucks. Poison his drink to make him go to a ledge close to the wardrobe, then you can do the rest of the opportunity. Okay, stand still. No. Whose drink? The golf guy's drink. It's fine, we're just gonna drag his corpse through town. It's gonna be fine. And I have nothing to read. Somebody's in big trouble. As long as nobody's turned him into a body bag. Oh, that'd be the worst. Seems like a much more annoying option. Yeah, but I really don't want to start again. <clears throat> the easy option would be start again, become the golf coach, put him in there, lure her down, put her in there. That'd be the easy option. And if I can't find his body, we might have to go with that one.
I'm not going to find his body, am I? We're going to have to do it properly. It looks like his body's not here. Shiza! If I finish it, man, what game will I play next? That's not how I work, my friend. <clears throat> I play games on a whim. You jerks! You went and got the body, didn't you? They totally went and got the body. Fine. Uh, replan. It's just not fair. It's just not cricket. Should be easy enough. Take out golf dude, hide him in the closet, summon her down, hide her in the closet, job done. Did I shoot him? Because if not, he can survive the fall. I did shoot him. I absolutely put a cap in his ass. <laughs> that was not my silenced gun. Well, shit. Shizer. It's fine, they'll relax real quick. Oh, there's a crowbar here. Getting 100% is going to take a lot of repetitiveness. Uh, potentially, yeah. Potentially. Right, I need to get him inside. Please leave. Where's he going? Oh, he heard. 
He heard. Who said that? Command, I've arrived at the location and it looks clear. Over. Good, good. <clears throat> dee, 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 dee. Man, there he's clear. <clears throat> One guy down. Now it's easy. Maybe. Just need this guy's phone. <clears throat> it's me. Roberto. Silvio let you off early. I want us to meet. Your room. Mm. I should say no. But you won't. See you soon. The perfect crime. <laughs> she comes in, put a bullet through a dome, shove her in the locker, live the dream. <clears throat> I wonder where I haven't been. I wonder where I haven't been. Got like six locations. I think it shows us them on the map though, so it's fine. Roberto Flowers, you shouldn't have. <clears throat> Candles. Oh, candles, you are right. Target down. Next up, Silvio Caruso. Dee -dee 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 -dee. Oh, yeah. Right, is there anything else we can do? Discover the areas. Push a target. Eliminate a target with the church bell. Disguise yourself as a priest. I don't think there's a priest outfit on a master difficulty. Maybe there is, though. Pretty sure I looked through the uh, whole place and I didn't find one. Right, where's the map? Where haven't we been? The graveyard. Two areas there. I 
Rocco! It's your first day at work! You didn't tell me your cousin was back in town. Ah, do I detect a certain attraction to the dashing private detective from Milan? Oh, what of it? He's cute. Actually, uh, well, I really shouldn't tell you this, but he's here about a case. The client is Francesca DeSantis. You know, the, the female doctor who's staying at the Villa Cruz. Mm. <laughs> I got a feeling today is going to be very busy. You're not wrong. Look, buddy, there's nothing going on here. Come out! Now! Okay. That's for being nosy. See, one of the challenges is to dress up as a scientist inside here, right? Which means stealing this guy's clothes. He doesn't have no clothes. He's also been bleeding from the eyes. What the hell? What kind of virus is this? Which means that you have to do that one on professional. Or you have to... Get a science coat and then come here. It's actually really awkward. And it's little things like that that make me think I'm not going to be able to find a priest outfit. <clears throat> See you at mass on Sunday. Wait up. Who are you? I know you. Don't worry about who I am, priest. So I think some of them you can only do on a professional. Because we're not allowed to take out the priest. Which means that there should just be an outfit lying around on the ground somewhere. But there totally isn't. Yoink. Yeah. There isn't one. Unless... It said I needed the ch Well, this building up here had a church key in it, which implies that someone from the church lives there. Which maybe implies that we can find a priest outfit in here. Look, church key. But I don't think there is one. I think you just can't do it on a... Uh... On master. Let's find out. Man of the cloth. Master. Man of the Cloth Master. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. 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 
Mm-hmm. It cannot be completed on master. That is why you Google it. Right. And Grave Robber is going to be a pain to complete on master as well, so we'll do both of those on professional. So let's... Go and get these locations. See, it sucks I got challenges you can't do on master. It's highly uncouth. Let's go to the graveyard. That'll unlock another bit of the map. <clears throat> Three to go. There's another one just up here. Hey, you! Is this one? Uh... Find a completed barbecue season silent assassin. How'd you manage to do it without anyone else getting uh, getting killed? That's braggable, that is. Okay. So we've got one up there, one there. And... One at the virus center. You knocked out a lot of people. <laughs> yeah, that's that's the way to do it, I guess. Right. Um, the beach square. There's a shop there. Wicked. I think that's the shop up there. And there's also another one quite close by, which is just up here. <laughs> this flower shop, maybe? Yeah, go and get someone to kick my ass, that's fine. <laughs> Still Italian town indeed. When you do challenges, you go, the story goes and do a few things in one location, then another. Yeah, see, I wanna... Hey buddy, do you wanna kill me?
Right. Now we've only got one place on the map to go. And that we can do just by doing this. Some of these challenges I think we can only do on um some of the other stories on the map. You made it. The virus prototype will be close by. Look for some type of quarantine unit. Any of you guys know this joker? There we go. So now we've just got kind of sketchy ones, honestly. Um, push a target into the wishing well. They don't even go near the wishing well. At least I don't think they do. Eliminate a target with the church bell. They don't go near the church bell. At least I don't think they do. These two we can only do on professional, really. That's that journalist, but he's not a target. <clears throat> yeah, the detective as well, but he's not a target. I think we might have to do these on the other stories, like the the writer and stuff. Potentially. Find and equip all disguises in Sapienza. I think for some of these, we're going to have to do them on the other story map. Uh, the same with the sniper and the plumber. Because look, assassinate three targets. We've only got two targets. Complete a contract. Disguise yourself as either the red or green plumber. Assassinate five targets in an accident. Only eliminate targets. So I think we're basically done with World of Tomorrow. Um, I think. Welcome to Sap. Welcome to the World of Tomorrow. Two more coins, huh? <clears throat> and then I think we've done everything specific to this one, except the two that we have to do on professional. Thanks for the coins, buddy. <clears throat> <laughs> so we'll throw these in the fountain, then we'll quit out, start as professional, get those two. Nice, nice. Very nice.
I'm curious about the outfits. I wonder if it includes the outfits from the other <clears throat> the other stories in Sapienza. It probably does. It probably does. <laughs> so we should be able to get two here relatively easily, maybe, depending on where the priest clothes are. He'll have an extra set line about. I should have brought a lockpick. Should have brought a lockpick. But it's fine. See, look, he's wearing clothes if you do it on this difficulty. Now, where could the priest's clothes be? Potentially down here. Well, shit. Look. I'm just gonna give us a log pick. It's gonna make our life easier. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Is it here? Nice. Hmm. Nice outfit. Hell yeah. Right. Let's um Complete the mission. Just so that we get the uh, <clears throat> nice little thing showing us that we've done everything. Because I quite like seeing it. You'll be late for your first day. <clears throat> Couldn't resist. <clears throat> you lucky bastard. Target down. 
Next up, Francesca DeSantis. Mm hmm. Yoink. <clears throat> it's so easy on professional. Like, it boggles the mind. You can just put a bullet through someone's head and still steal their outfit. It's crazy. You're missing two locations for the challenge and you're sad. Yeah, I had to look them up on the map. my smack talk. I didn't expect two of those guys to be there. What the hell? Well, whatever. Right. Find and equip all disguises in Sapienza. I feel like that has to include the extra stories. I don't, I don't see what five I could have missed. Million Sapienza. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Plumber outfit. Uh, I've done both of those, I think. Maybe I haven't done the green one. Maybe I haven't done the green one. Sod it. We'll do it on professional. I can't be asked. How many women outfits are there? I don't think they count. I know I'm going against my principles by doing this one on professional. For just wearing uniforms, I can't be asked. Um, I don't think I did the green plumber. I know where he is though, so it's fine. And he's not in there. Red plumber's in there. Uh, da, 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 da. Sanguine oh. stylist, really? Wow. They've got their own That's custom sta uh, stylist. I thought the sanguine shop was closed. Hmm. Looking for outfits. Purpose on the stairs. Mm 
Uh huh. Four left. Waiter. I haven't done waiter. I haven't done cyclist, I think. Waiter, cyclist, green plumber, and then there'll be one more. Uno mas. Hmm. Hi there. Generic. Uh, yeah, I did the clown. Generic church staff, maybe. Thank you. Looking pretty fly. <clears throat> I don't think I've done waiter. Oh, waiter. Two more. Hey. The cyclist does just pretend he's injured, yeah. Green plumber, and then there's one more. Huh? Oh my god! Oh no! Who is that? One more. It might be church staff, you know. I've dressed up as the priest. I don't think I've dressed up as generic church staff, unless the morgue guy counts as church staff. Am I allowed in? I'm happy I got through to you, sir. You didn't get through to shit. Uh, da -da -da. there he is. <clears throat> One more. Right. Church staff. I think I've done. Priest. I've definitely done. Store clerk. Barber in the hair shop. Barber in the hair shop. I think I've done a barber in a hair shop. Where's the hair shop? Down here, I think. Isn't it the guy who was talking about the PI? You didn't tell me your 
cousin was back in town. He's just a stylist. God damn it. To the dashing private detective from Milan. Oh, what of it? He's Oh no. I've already done it though. Did I dress like the policeman? Um I don't think there is a policeman, right? The detective I did, the guys who wear black. Bohemian Man, I did that. Street performer, I did that. PI, I did that. Oscar Lafayette, I did that. Red Plumber, I did that. The butler. The butler! The butler! The goddamn butler. I don't think I did the butler. It's totally the butler. The butler did it. With the candlestick. In the kitchen. It's the goddamn butler. Thank you. <clears throat> Is the Mike Tyson match going to happen tomorrow? I am the last person to ask about that. I didn't roleplay as Evil Butler, no. I totally should have. Right, none of the targets go near the Wishing Well. And none of them go near the Church Bell. Unless I'm missing something, which I may very well be. But I will be right back. Eliminate a target with the church bell. Here's a question. If I look at the next one, does it still have that? If I look at one of the other ones, does it still have that challenge? Also, I've got two mission stories I need to do. I'm sure I did that mission story, man. I'm sure I did. Like, twice. But anyway, if I go to, um... Oh, we might be able to get them through these, right? The escalations. Yeah, see, this doesn't have it. So you have to do it on World of Tomorrow. But they never go. Oh, they never go there. Right, let's do the two mission stories. I'm doing it on professional so it can give me little little hints because I know I've done at least one of those. And you know what? I'm tired of this map. I am tired of it. I don't mind moving on to like the icon. That's the last of your worries, man. Fine. 
got a disguise. Get the flowers. Got the flowers. This was like the first thing we did on this map. Like, I don't know why it's not saying that we've done the mission story. This is just standard procedure. We're all friends here. Yes, we are. All friends. And you're good to go. Thanks a lot. Thanks, man. <clears throat> Time is of the essence for you guys. Chop, chop, son. Flowers for Mr. Caruso? Well, where are they? <sighs> go find them. I've got the man back empty handed. Really, some people. Flowers for Mr. Caruso? Ah, excellent. You can leave them on Mrs. Caruso's grave in the garden. Come along, I'll show you the way. Maybe after we deliver the flowers, he goes to church. Such a devoted son. Maybe he goes to church after we deliver the flowers? Is such a thing even possible? It is his mother's death day. I've never seen either of them leave the mansion, apart from to go to the science lab. You think he'll ever learn Russo? Nah. I've just never seen it. I still think 10 centimeter grass is way too tall, personally. So, down the stairs near the cliff. You can't miss it. I will inform Senor Caruso. You will be pleased. Yeah, then a bell would fall on his head, exactly. But, uh, there needs to be a way to get him to go to the church, or her to go to the church. Good work, 47. This should keep Caruso distracted for a while. Mission story completed. So... Call me crazy. But I've done that many times. I wonder why it wasn't marked as... Maybe because I didn't let the conversation play out? Grass should be tall otherwise it dries. 10 centimeters though. 10 centimeters is like... It'd knack of your shoes. That's my beef with it. Ten centimeters is pretty damn tall for grass. <clears throat> for like your lawn. If it's like a field, fair enough. But for your lawn, ten centimeters? Just seems a bit extreme to me. Right, we're going to let this guy do his thing, and we're going to see if he decides to go to the church afterwards. There has to be a way to get him to go to the church. Or her. But she's very focused on the lab, I don't know why she'd go to the church. But this guy's got a very good reason. Go on, get out of here. Shoot.
See, if you can do it on the escalations, that'd be alright, but I don't think you can. There might be an escalation that lets you do it. Yeah, he's going to give his little speech. Great. I am close now, mother. You're a real douchebag. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Doesn't half go on. Look, bodyguard. Back off. What are you doing here? Go away! <laughs> Brought this on yourself, man. Hey! Hey there, get up! Right, what's he gonna do now? Maybe he'll go to church. I got a church, Caruso. You want to go to church? Job, job. You're on the clock, man. No, he's just going back inside. We're going to give him the worst day of his life. He's already thinking about his mother. Now we just need to make him feel guilt. Dr. 
Dr. Lafayette speaking. Do you need help? I mean, like, real help? No, I just need you to leave. I'll write it out with my gun. Trust me, this plan is infallible. What the fuck? Help! Yes. I need help! That's gonna Get there before word spreads. Maybe if he visits his mother and then he sees the psychiatrist, maybe he'll be like, you know what? I need to go to church. I'm feeling really bad about things. Is such a thing even possible? Maybe. If I tried to drop the bell on someone, perhaps it accepts anyone as a target. Same with the well. Um, I haven't tried. Man, I'm here now. And the area is clear. Over. There's no denying I have not tried that. Occupado, man. Hey, would you mind a little privacy? Please? F off. I was in here first. Would you mind a little privacy? Who does he think he is? Dragon unconscious person under bell, drop the bell. Yeah. Yeah, that is an option. <laughs> I'm going to see if I can manipulate him to go there. <clears throat> but if not... Find 
Then I'm just not sure. Like, if it's saying do that, logically, there must be a way to get them there. Otherwise, why would it say it? Otherwise, why would it say it? There has to be a way. Oscar Lafayette. I have an appointment with Mr. Caruso. Ah, yes. Senor Caruso has been informed of your arrival. Please, follow me. I shall take you to his quarters. Mm. And may I say, it is well that you are here, Doctor. Master has not been himself lately. Might be for online play where you can have different I, targets. Well, yeah, maybe. I hope you are as good maybe. As say. Don't worry, I am. This seems weird though, because what if you were playing it offline? Like, oh uh, well, I guess you can't. <clears throat> Doctor, good to see. I guess you can't 100% the game Martin. if you're playing it offline. And that just doesn't seem cool. Maybe I'm giving them too much credit, though. Uh, what's up, Doc? Not a lot. I'm actually going to be his psych uh, psychologist today. Senor Caruso's private quarters. <clears throat> Meanwhile, I'm going to Google it. Best of luck. Uh. Bells are ringing. The bells are ringing. Sapienza. The renowned Dr. Oscar Lafayette. Mr. Caruso, shall we begin? If you insist. So, Ether sends a specialist to rummage through my brain. They must think I'm losing it again. Relax. Start by telling me what's on your mind. Isn't it obvious? I'm under a lot of pressure. Work. Mother Everyone just says do it year. by making a contract. Stress manifests itself in the strangest ways, I am told. Your mother, Isabella. Would you like to talk about her? Look, I... I know what you're driving at. My neuroses, my anxiety, my social phobias. Not mm. the least my pathological fear of women. It's all deeply rooted. Go on. I had a girlfriend, you know. In high school. Pretty, too. Popular. And I was shy. Bookish. It should have worked. Not outside those stupid teen dramedies. But it did. Everyone says make a contract. Or use a contract. Then Just seems cheap. Decided that Emilio wasn't a good influence on me. So she paid the gardener's son to seduce her. He was 20. Roguish. Rode a motorcycle. Hmm. Mother, she, she had pictures taken, showed them to me on prom night. Pictures of him riding his Romantic motorcycle. Love is fleeting, she said. Only a mother's love endures. What, what do you want me to say? I Nothing. I want you to go mother. to church. I hated my mother, same as everybody else. Isabella bullied you, shamed and belittled you, made you feel like a failure. All to keep you, a last and loyal son, from ever leaving, too. Stop it. I don't want to hear it. Your mother was a monster. Is that not why you killed her? What? How dare you? You couldn't breathe. She smothered you. So you smothered her. 
Is that how it happened? <laughs> yes. All right. I there we go, he's confessing to us. I did it. Now he just needs to go to confession. Are you happy now? Is that supposed to be cathartic? Well, guess again, Doctor. Back to the drawing board. I think we have made some excellent progress. Same time tomorrow? Good day, Mr. Caruso. Shortest therapy session ever. Wonder how much he gets paid for that. Come on, buddy. Now go to church. You know you wanna. Doctor, welcome. You know you want to go to church. Go and talk to the lady and then be like, you know what? Actually, I'd like to see what they say to each other. You, I'm back. I'm not allowed in there, probably. Yes, well, life goes on. Mother has had a long and fruitful existence. Now, if you'll excuse me... No! ...to practice my golf, I will see you at the lab. Oh, my God. All the charm of a dead fern. Wow, she said that right to his face. What the hell? All the charm of a dead fern. Thanks, lady. Come on, buddy. You don't want to go play golf. You want to go and confess. Please don't go and play golf. Go to church, man. It'll be good for you. Yeah, keep walking, doctor. Ah, <sighs> rip. Listen, I think this will be good for you. It's therapeutic. Hello, Doctor. Have a nice day, Doc. I will. I'll have a nice day fucking with this guy. Hello, Doctor Lafayette. Uh, oh, it's on the floor below, right? Totally.
God damn it. Also, you can totally roam around this place as a psych psychologist. Quite generously. <clears throat> what I'm thinking is we don't spook him out with the hat. We just spook him out enough so he doesn't pass out. But he starts feeling really bad. They're going to get pissy if I do this. Go outside, dude. I guess they don't care. <clears throat> this is the latest in psychotherapy. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Can I push him over the edge? But without KOing him. If not, we're just gonna have to contract it, as much as it hates, as I hate to say it, we're just gonna have to contract it. That's what everyone's saying. It really pains me to think that you have to do that. Really, really pains me. Come on. Come inside. Go to confession. You idiots! I need help! What? Move the package to safety. Now! On it! 47. Caruso is heading for his seaplane. Don't allow him to escape. Talk about exaggeration. Senor Caruso has been hit. Latest and modern techniques. Right over there. Don't worry, I'm a doctor.
this is hurting you more than it's hurting me. No wait, the other way around. This is hurting me more than it's hurting you. Get therapied. This is my therapy shotgun. Just pull the trigger and let all your pain fall away. <laughs> they called me a madman when I suggested pistol therapy. But who's laughing now? I'm dragging him there. It's just a fact. Command area is clear. Please advise. Over. Sure wish I had my gun, but I'll make do. I'll make do. <laughs> this is what he gets for trying to run away from his fears. It's just not healthy. You have to face them. <clears throat> Head on. Otherwise your fears will drag you to a church and drop a bell on your head. <laughs> I wonder what the most effective way of getting him there is. Fifth town is going to be pretty painful.
Dream therapy. Actually quite lenient when you're dragging a corpse. Surprisingly lenient. They run up and give you an ultimatum instead of just shooting. Okay, townsfolk, don't freak out. This is part of an intense therapeutic program. He signed the consent forms. Hey, hey, you can't do whatever you like with a cadaver. There are laws, you know. Someone help me! Bullshit! Hey, wake up! Something terrible! <laughs> Goddamn! Target spotted. What the Repeat, target spotted. You, drop the body, now! <laughs> Slow and steady. On then, go and tell someone. What happened to asking me to drop the body? They're not playing by their own rules! They woke him up! Over there. 
Oh my god, they woke him up. Shit! Ah! It was going so well! Come on, 47, you can move faster than this. Ah, crap! Well, it was a good attempt. I'm just going to contract it. That's annoying. It could be for the escalations, you know. Let's do the escalations. Eliminate that guy using a sniper rifle. Okay. <clears throat> I love a good escalation. This will uh, be a nice little break. This one's a sniper escalation. It's unlikely we can do it with this one. Who is it? Same. That guy. <clears throat> Alberto Genovese. Rocco, get down here this minute. Hey, Rocco. Special delivery. Come on, Rocco. Oh, Rocco. I've got a package with your name on it.
Nice. Perfect cry, sort of. Except for that guy being a witness. If you ignore that, the perfect cry. Four star? See, look, the bell and the well one are on this list. The bell and the well one are on this list. We can maybe do it with escalations. Eliminate him with a sniper rifle. A naked guy. A naked guy. This time I'll bring a lockpick. Where's there a naked guy? Down there, apparently. <clears throat> Lockpick will make this a bit smoother. So glad we got this improved sniper rifle. The one you start with is terrible. Excellent. He doesn't have anywhere I can store him, does he? Because they are going to search this area. But how much will they search it? Son of a bitch. No, don't go downstairs. Whew. Okay. <clears throat> so where's this other guy? Oh, he's over there. Okay. What's up here?
Perfect. <laughs> Starting the runes, you can see both. Oh, that's pretty nice. Excellent, excellent. Speedboats are the only exits available. Start in the ruin, huh? I was hoping it'd ask us to snipe more people, honestly, as opposed to other restrictions. I got us out of sight one as well. Did I? Ah. Oh, you can get another joint there. That's interesting. Nice, nice. 
I probably got that out of sight one. Some of the previous objectives have changed. Eliminate with a headshot. Yeah, that's fine. That doesn't really make a difference. <laughs> I was hoping there'd be more targets. I was really hoping there'd be more targets. Maybe the final escalation will add the third target? That'd be nice. Nice. <clears throat> That's so much more efficient than the way I was doing it. You want to make your first? Yeah, that's fine. Thirty seconds. This escalation's easy. I do appreciate sniper escalations, though. I'm a big fan. I wish the uh, escalations mixed it up a bit more. Because you're basically just doing the same thing three times in a row. It's not really escalating anything. Right, I'm killing him first. Because he's the one who patrols, so I don't want to risk it. Whereas the other guy just stands fishing the whole time. Stop moving your head! Uh-huh, uh-huh. Might indeed have trouble. 
Not really though, we just killed two random guys. Too easy! Right, I'm going to take like a five minute break and eat a sandwich and then we'll do the other escalations because it looks like we can get these these feats that we want from the escalations. But yeah, I shall be back briefly.
That was a good sandwich. Sausage and bacon. Delicious. Right. <clears throat> Filiberto Nucci. Is it just kill him? In whatever way we want. Definitely want to take a sniper rifle. Who's Filiberto Nucci? Doors can be blown open using high powered weapons. Shoot the lock. Really? <clears throat> I did not know that one. One of his gardeners, huh? Let's ruin it up then. Whenever it says kill them with whatever means you want, we want to try and sniper it. So that we can get those sniper challenges. Those sweet, sweet sniper challenges. We need to kill five more targets with sniper rifles. <clears throat> Look for anyone suspicious. Nice and easy. Alexis Casio. Casso. Okay. We'll see where he is. <clears throat> Looks like he might be one of the guards as well. That'd be alright. Hello, Toyd. Snipe that guy from here. <clears throat> Sorry, buddy. 
do kind of have this coming. <laughs> Steal this guy's uniform. <clears throat> and now, we just need to find a new vantage point where we can get that guy. <clears throat> Which should be fine. Where is he, though? <clears throat> Where is he? You utter jerks. I didn't want to do this, but you forced my hand. The alarm went off. Ah, holy shit! I tried being lenient. <clears throat> Tried to be respectful. I think you might have some trouble. <laughs> Not happy about having to kill those guys. But I can live with it. <clears throat> Better Vargas. Oh, poor guy. <clears throat> poor, poor guy. The poor golf coach.
<clears throat> Maybe I can get my two for one. <clears throat> Maybe. We still got that challenge to kill two people with one bullet. Vargas and that groundskeeper <clears throat> should be fairly close to each other. They may cross paths. <laughs> Thanks, Toyd. Much appreciated. Every single one of these staircases is broken in exactly the same spot. That is some dedicated breakage. <clears throat> Caruso C. Right, can I kill the groundskeeper and <coughs> the golfer at the same time with one shot? I think so. I think their paths will cross. I believe it with all my heart. The closest we've got so far to two guys. <coughs> so... You know. The timing on it might have to be pretty good. We can slow down time. Shit! Sorry guys! Look, it was an accident. Look how that guy's totally unfazed by it, like, whatever. Come on, golf man, move! Golfman, I hate you. Fine. Time to do this the old fashioned way. Hey guys, nice conversation you're having. Oh no, Caruso is getting away. Good job we don't give two craps about Caruso. Fly free, Caruso! Fly free! Free as a bird! <clears throat> Try sniper rifle. I'm just gonna let him leave, it's fine. He's not hurting anyone. Security is getting tighter.
I'm not gonna do this every time we do this escalation. I just want our double kill. <clears throat> this is gonna be the easiest way to get it. <clears throat> I'm a coming. Now, positioning is going to be key. Chase Sage, 97. This is required. No one likes a snitch, dude. <clears throat> Command, I have nothing to report from my current location. Command, I have nothing to report. Right. <clears throat> Come on. Can I get three with one bullet? One up the challenge.
Oh, I'm sorry, Vargas. I didn't mean to move you. You were perfect there. God damn it! Yeah, that's fine. Maybe. Right, let's go get our gun. <clears throat> Can't believe I left it all the way up there. Oh, what a fool I've been. <clears throat> now this can penetrate multiple bodies. We know that because it says it in its uh, description. So, all we need to do is line up the perfect angle that's going to hit all three of their heads. God damn it, how do I get down? <clears throat> Aha! Truly we are the Master Sniper. Aim cannon at correct place. Yeah, but we have a challenge which is to kill three people with a... Um, uh, two people with a single bullet. I think I can get all three if I aim there. Look at that! Come on, man. Don't be like that. I can still hear that seaplane for some reason. I do like this gun, there's just no denying it. It's pretty good, it's pretty fun. Another successful mission. In Legend of Grimrock 2, there is a Ratman carrying one of those cannons using it as a handgun. That sounds pretty good.
Uh, kill them all within 30 seconds. Look, game. I didn't want to cheese you, but you're forcing it on me. You're forcing me to cheese. <clears throat> Within 30 seconds. The only problem there is that third guy. So we just need a different vantage point. I wish I'd known that was going to be the escalation, because then I would have done that triple headshot this time. But I'm not setting that up again. No way. It's just unfortunate that the third guy, you can't really see him. It's fine though, it just means we need a different vantage point. Namely, on top of the observatory. Thank you very much. Right. Look, guards, I really don't appreciate you. So you can totally get them with a double bullet legitimately by shooting them from here. It'd be a right pain in the ass. Though. Oh no, they found a body. Oh no, they found another body. Oh, what? He comes there? Are you kidding me? So I could have just waited. You scumbag. Uh, where is he? There he is. No, don't hide there, man. Ah, you utter jerk! Run! Run in fear! Run for your life! In the next 10 seconds, preferably. No, don't cower! Don't cower, man! Run! Ah! Right, now that I know that the guy moves, we just need to stay at the top and wait. Oh, my, my cursor was literally right dead centre on him when the time ran out. I did miss him, there's no denying that. The fault is all mine. <clears throat> I should have killed those two guys first and uh, killed the guard last because he wouldn't have run away. 
I can accept the blame on that one. It's fine though. No, I shouldn't use mouse man. You don't understand how much I hate using the mouse. I like it for strategy games, but for everything else, absolutely not. I just have to live with my lack of aiming skills. Mouse is cute, it has a tail. Well, yeah, that's true. Right, we just need to wait for him then, I guess. I wonder if you can shoot him through the glass. It's actually just a waiting game now. Wait for him to get nosy and come and see what's going on. And then watch my mouse skills fail. Uh, my controller skills fail. Come on. Kill him last. Kill him last. No, don't just stand against the wall, you lazy son of a bitch. God, I hate that guy. Come on. What's he doing? Tying his shoe. Come on, man. Stop dicking about! Right. Weapons in eye, divine, cybermancy, or wall piercing. I think some of the weapons you can get are wall piercing in this, depending on the wall. We're in the earlier Hitman games anyway. <clears throat> right, what's the last escalation gonna be? In Hitman 1 you could, but not in Hitman 2. Really? Is it gonna change the targets? Deadly landmines have been added. Find and equip the dis- Look, I ain't disarming no mines. What the hell? Another pointless escalation. Watch out, there's mines! Sniper rifle's really overpowered in Hitman. Like, really, really overpowered. The only thing is you can't really get Silent Assassin with it. But, <clears throat> apart from that, it's pretty damn good. Put the silenced one... No, no. Doesn't even matter if it's silenced or not. You glad that Hitman 2 escalations only have three levels? Yeah, it's a bit much, right? <clears throat> if they if the escalations did 
more relevant stuff. I'd quite enjoy them. I forgot the rifle. But, um... <clears throat> they just had meaningless stuff for the most part. Like, oh, watch out. Now there's a minefield in the place where you're never gonna go. Alright, play the waiting game. You know, I had that coming. Let's be honest, I had that coming. <laughs> Look, it said the mines were in the garden. That's not the garden. They lied to me. I was fed false information by the game. <laughs> it said, in my defense, it said that they were in the garden. Okay, look. I'm not amused. I am a little, actually. This makes it a bit more interesting. Not really, though, because I just have to not go near the wall. Beep, beep, beep. Can you see the mines? Oh, you totally can. I thought you needed to get a special detector to see them. You probably can shoot them, yeah. Let's find out. Why would you agree to that job? Like, yeah, I'll stand on top of this tower. By the way, you're standing literally right next to an explosive mine. Don't get too close to it. Now we're playing the waiting game again. <laughs> Gotta kill time somehow. Need some backup now. Now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right.
Gotta make sure I don't walk into any mines. I don't know what it was talking about with that mine detector then. To find the mines, you need to find a special mine detector. You just don't. You just use instinct. Or did it say to disarm the mines? Maybe it said to disarm them. Now, I was hoping that would give us an opportunity to push someone down the well. And this one is not in World of Tomorrow, right? Maybe it is. Kill this guy as a lab technician. Okay. <clears throat> the last escalation is the hardest. We'll see about that. I mean, the other two were pretty easy, so then it's not much competition. Following orders, I'm leaving the area in an orderly fashion. <clears throat> Look, I know you're going to get pissed about this, but I'm stealing your plane. One star, I'll take it. Hack the laptop in the lab. Okay. I feel like 47 isn't much of a hacker, but maybe he is?
Come on. They don't run away, are oh, you jerk? Over there. Good job, man. Oh, well, this guy's a lab technician. Oh, I'm such a fool. That's fine. I'll just kill him first. I remember to put away your weapons before being poisoned to death. <laughs> totally. Hey. You, go and tell them where I am. Hey, buddy. What is he doing? Someone please help me. Go on, go and get some help. You've got two challenges left. Yeah, I knew you'd beat me, man. To be fair, I bet you had a bunch of them done already. There's my excuse. Boom. Take him down. He's gone. Last visual two. What? Oh, did they destroy the laptop? Oh my god. Fine. Fine. I'll do it the easy way. Can't believe they've done this. <clears throat> they didn't get me, they got the laptop.
I was willing to be kind. To be fair, you started much later than me. Well, maybe. But I'm assuming you went starting from zero challenges as well. Overzealous. Overzealous. Reloading nearly full magazine should waste remaining bullets. I agree. I wholeheartedly agree. Let me hack in peace. Door closed. <laughs> Ugh. Curse that door. It maybe takes twenty seconds to hack this damn thing. Hey, wait a minute. Hey. <sighs> 20 seconds is brutal. <clears throat> Guys, time out. Peace in our time. Peace in our time. Get out of here, guys. <clears throat> um, <clears throat> I don't think it's difficult. I'm just being careless. We'll see what the the rest of the escalation adds in. <clears throat> I'm just being careless. It's actually all right. It's quite enjoyable. I sure wish they'd go near the well, though. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
Aruga. <laughs> See things like that and being careless. Right. I was hoping when the escalations would take us out to the church, but I don't think they're going to. Kill Bertoldo Velado. Okay. You gotta be kidding. No. <laughs> hey guys a challenge. Some of the previous objectives have changed. Kill him using an amputation knife and an explosive golf ball. You son of a bitch. You son of a bitch. Fine. Fine. He's going to see that body, but that's fine. Get the knife. And then we can get the golf ball from the safe house and then it should be fine, right? Just throw the golf ball at 
hit one of their heads, knife the other one. Should be fine. I wonder what the last escalation will be. Ooh. Got a bell on their head, that'd be amazing. Yes, I understand. Guys, the killer's back there. Command, you copy? We found a lifeless body. Drop bell on head, push them in the well. There really should be a way to do those without having to do a custom contract. Like, I mean, drop the bell, you could, you could just drag them in, but still. The well one, there really isn't. Listen, I'm just a humble chef. Hey, what are you doing here? I guess the question is, how do I know which is which? Right? How do I know which is which? They look exactly the same. Is whiter. Yeah, I guess so. Doing the Lord's work. Let's 
Let's go get our golf ball. Security's in the his house. <clears throat> come on, come in, you copy. Yeah, I'm here now. Right. Is this guy the white one or the Oh shit, he woke up. He's that one, right? Explosive golf ball as lab technician. I'm not worried about killing myself here. Don't worry guys, this is for science. Right. And then... Last guy with an amputation knife, it doesn't matter what uniform we're wearing. This should be easy enough. Just throw it at his head. And then there's one more level of the escalation. I wonder what that will do. Fee-fi fit lie-o, fee-fi fit lie-o, fee-fi fit lie-o, strumming on the old banjo. Let's go. <clears throat> Take the little car away. Let's go. Right.
Come on, mix it up again. <clears throat> Eliminate all targets with katana while disguised as the plague doctor. The katana may only be carried while disguised as the plague doctor. Alright, I'll do that. That sounds fun. <clears throat> um, let's start in the mansion grounds. That sounds like a right hoot. Let's do it. Mm-hmm. What the hell? Mm-hmm. I respect a man of the earth, but you got no business here. Yeah, 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 I got no business here. <clears throat> Where do I get the katana? Where do I get the katana? I assumed it'd be next to the Plague Doctor, right? Great, okay. I didn't want it to come to this, but it already has. Why would Plague Doctor need Katana? <clears throat> but why would anyone need a katana? It's not exactly a necessary item. You need a katana when you don't have a sword to slice heads. Well, that's true. We need a katana, that's for sure. Going, man. Over there. Snake's gone hiding. Echo Alpha, can you see him? It was hard to sound the assassin this escalation. Yeah, I bet it was. Oh, Katana. Oh, Katana. If I was a Katana, where would I be? Maybe the grandma had a katana.
Oh, Grandma, I mean, Mother, did you have a katana? No? In the attic, hidden by some boxes. Excellent. At least my skills of killing everyone are going to come in handy. As long as I don't accidentally shoot the guys in the face who we need to kill with a katana. That son of a bitch. Now you remember you used a katana. Ah, uh, yeah, uh, you did say it, right? You were like, can you get a katana on this mission? Hey, guys. It's possible. Just look for a combination code like Ms. DeSantis. In the attic, huh? I don't see no katana. I might be blind though. There it is. <clears throat> Nice, nice. Jesus! That guy scared the crap out of me. Thank you very much.
Hey, buddy, can you hold this for a sec? Nice. <laughs> <clears throat> Someone's making trouble. Must be high on drugs. That's a bit presumptuous. Over there. He's over there. Mhm. <laughs> <laughs> There's something satisfying about just calmly walking through this map, like a T-1000. It's really, really satisfying. Anyone left? If they're wise enough to run away, they can live. If they just stand there like idiots, then really it's just Darwinism. Rocky mistake. Oh my god. Go on, go and get your friends. Eventually, he'll bring up the people I need to kill. And then life will be good. Come on. Ah, hold it. He's over there. <laughs> Come on. You're going to get sent up to investigate eventually. I think one of them's been sent up. Maybe. No, not yet. Where is the other one then? 
Ah, they're both just chilling down there. Need to make them panic more. Lucky bastard. Go on, go and get someone. Well done, Rifi, well done. I did not think this through. <clears throat> okay, I think we're good. Right, let's start making our way down. I'm a bit worried about making our way down, but... It's probably fine. Master man, you sure did. You dumbass.
Now, where's my katana? Such a fool! Slow and steady. Right, okay. Let's do that a bit wiser. A little bit wiser. Not too much wiser, but a little bit. I need to prioritize. Number one priority. <clears throat> Get a key card. Number two priority. KO those two guards. Anyone else? Next priority, hack that laptop. Wait, they're still finding bodies.
Original plan, kill everyone in suit was better. It was more entertaining. <clears throat> it was more stylish. But it was way more risky. Now! Alright, later, Rifi. Jesus Christ, they're still finding bodies. Need more ammo. Killing people's a real ammo sink. Dead men tell no tales, perfect stealth ops, exactly. Oh my god, he survived. Didn't really want to resort to the shotgun, but... They've not left me with much of a choice. Hey, Zoltando! Right, let's hack the laptop. Need some help here. Beep, 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 beep. Then we just need the katana and the outfit. Hey, I know you can hear me. I'm talking to you. You don't want to Right. Now all we need. Is a katana in the outfit. Which should be fine because nobody up here knows we're a psycho. I think. Yeah. Someone with a katana dressed as a plague doctor. You didn't realize plague doctors could be weeps. <laughs> totally. Let's go get our katana. And I think as a soldier we're allowed to wield it, so that's fine.
Uh oh. You. <sighs> Do you have that psycho look about? Is it the boldness? Yeah. You're not wrong. Finally, some pistol ammo. I figured that'd be a double kill as well. I didn't even pick up the katana. I'm such a fool. I just killed those two guys and was like, well, job done. Don't see anything. Oh my god! What? I need a drink, I'll be right back. Right, we're going psycho. Deep near half of my sandwich. Maybe we won't go psycho. Maybe we'll go totally silent assassin. It. Delicious. Right. He is staring at his menacingly. Roberto, what do you think of Miss DeSantis? The woman runs my lab. She is a striking woman, to be sure. Uh, we've only talked briefly. Uh huh. They've only talked briefly. <clears throat> Right, the gloves are off. 
Or more appropriately, <clears throat> the gloves are on. Put down. Give me your ammo. <clears throat> I'm not gonna kill everyone. Only people who get in my way. You think every lab developing weaponized viruses should have plague doctor uniforms as standard company attire? Yeah! I agree. Forty seven's clearly helping all these people that humans are extremely imbalanced. Totally. It's just like our propane therapy last night. This is impossible. Just <clears throat> Right, we need to get downstairs. Gunshots are indeed faster than leeches. It's the modern age. You got to move with the times. Right, where am I going? Back to the observatory, ideally. See, I can be stealthy. <clears throat> Nobody's seen us yet. Man, I got nothing to report from my current location. Over.
They're all too busy worrying about the dead people to worry about us. Now, <clears throat> kill these two with a katana. Jesus Christ! The party going on. That was a bit rough, but you understand we have to take our precautions. <laughs> like how that one guy was just like, I don't want to die. Easy does it. Peekaboo. Yeah, <clears throat> <laughs> welcome back, Rifi. <laughs> They'll calm down soon, and they'll probably even bring our katana to that nice little chest. They're generous like that. That guy really likes to hedge his bets. I'm at a possible crime scene. I've got a person on the ground. He's a possible casualty. Meanwhile, he's got a bullet through his head. <clears throat> it's possible that he has been injured. Shot of Kings. <clears throat> right, I just need to hack the thing now. I don't even need to be the Plague Doctor anymore. So, I just need a Scientist Man coat. Thank you. Ooh. 
Hello everybody, I am Science Man, come to do science things. Yeah, the Plague Doctor outfit is really cool. Yeah, vacate the premises, dudes. <clears throat> I'm a hazmat man. Help me! Anyone have a line of sight? Anyone? Command the lab's clear. Copy. Roger that. Get out of here, dude. I don't want to kill you, but I will do. That's the spirit. Look, don't worry about what I'm doing, man. <clears throat> The lab is closed. How do I close these doors? Are you okay? If you can hear me, make a sound. Get over here! Hey, don't move! Jesus Christ! Whatever. Get out of my lab. <clears throat> Warning, dangerous compound. Warning, dangerous compound. Processing. No backup for you, buddy. Man, I'm here. <clears throat> I just want to hack that computer. Is that too much to ask? Just want to hack the computer. Ah! <clears throat> Please stop sending, guys. Ten seconds, come on. 
I think they're out of goons. <clears throat> now all I need to do is get to that plane. That's it. Just get to the plane. <coughs> Even I can't screw this up. Oh. Happy days. Five star? Come on. I earned it. Zero stars. Look, zero stars is a bit harsh. I at least accomplished the goal. Surely that's worth one star. <clears throat> zero stars. Slap in the face, that's what that is. Right. All we're missing... Oh wait, that's Paris. <clears throat> All we're missing on World of Tomorrow... Is these two, and these, which... <clears throat> Assassinate five targets. See, we don't have a... Is that another one I'm going to have to do through a contract? Because we don't have a mission with five targets. <clears throat> so how are you supposed to do that? Riddle me that. <clears throat> I guess the question is, clearly Bowser's hiding somewhere. Yeah, maybe. On this bonus mission, can I still do those challenges? No. No. So I have to do them on that one. <clears throat> I can do that one, pacify 10 individuals without getting spotted. Let's do that one. <clears throat> can you do it through multiple runs? That's a good question. Help, I'm locked in the morgue. Sort of. Right. <clears throat> Let's get our outfit and then we just need to pass by ten people. How hard can that be? Oh, plumber. I know you're here somewhere. Was that the plumber down there? It totally was. 
God damn it. <coughs> El Plumerino. Right. Um. Let's make three targets by drowning them. We could do that one, technically. Got to use a lead pipe. Is there even a lead pipe down here? I know there's a lead pipe next to the green plumber. You'd think the red one would have one as well if it was giving you the option of which to be. But I guess not. That's fine. <clears throat> Now they should let us in. Probably not with our gun, but they will let us in, I think. I think they'll let us in. Hey, I've come uh, to see my brother. This will be over in no time. You're good to go, sir. Thank you for your patience. Okay, let's... One. He was jumping on a target to kill him with an option, that would be great. Three.
four. Let's see. They'll give up pretty quickly. Come on, give it up. I was just going to farm that guy, but where's the fun in that? Entering the ether lab requires a key card and a uniform. Luckily, it seems both are within reach. <laughs> God damn it. Ah, crap. Two more. Would be one more if I hadn't accidentally screwed up that one guy. Not allowed here, huh?
Die, 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 die. Huh? A body? No. Command, be advised we have a casualty. Stay alert and proceed with caution. Perfect. <clears throat> Come on. Oh, thank you. <clears throat> Can I do any of the other ones? I don't think so. Maybe. <clears throat> Need a screwdriver. Hmm. <clears throat> Doesn't say we're not allowed to be caught, so this one should be all right. Screwdriver. Hmm. Can I come in? Hold it, friend. No maintenance crew this way. Go talk to my boss. Don't bother me. Okay. Okay. Ah, crap. <clears throat> I just want a screwdriver. This'll be fine. He'll come out to play golf or throw a screwdriver into his head. That'll be one of them. Sometimes I feel like my impatience gets the better of me. I'd like my screwdriver back, but that's fine. If we 
need mate you cannot enter these Okay, for playing with guns. I didn't want to do this, you guys escalated. Had to go and escalate the situation. I missed my real gun. <clears throat> How was that? Ah! Well, you know what? We got one of the kills. That's fine. Uh, this time I would like to start in the kitchen. That way we can keep our real gun. We can try and get our two uh, Luigi kills. Mr. Caruso has specifically demanded this. Someone's been hurt. Looks really bad. There's nobody around. Please, no. It doesn't say, like, don't get spotted, right? No. Wait, does it have to all be in the same? You have to... <laughs> There is no mission where you can do that. Oh my god. There's no mission with four targets. This stuff is so annoying, man. I'm gonna have to do it with contracts. I really don't wanna do it with contracts. Ah. <sighs> 
Sapienza. Um, four targets. Specific melee weapon. Nope. There has to be one for Mario and Luigi, right? Surely there's one for Mario and Luigi. Fine. We're making our own. really annoying. You shouldn't have to do this, in my opinion, to complete challenges. All challenges should be possible in the base game without creating custom contracts. But I'll do it. I'll do it. this guy Don't move a muscle Hey Okay <clears throat> Seems reasonable. And then I want two people near the red plumber. I wonder how many targets you can have. Let's do an all-in-one. You can have five. Okay, that's fine. Red plumber, where are you? Maybe there are more. <laughs> hey, maybe if I find more, I'll uh, finally meet my friend. Uh-oh. 
And then we want to kill the detective by pushing him in the well. What am I working on now? Um... Just finishing off Sapienza, which we're very close to doing. <clears throat> well, Sapienza's main mission. Then we've got the uh, Mr. Santis, special missions. Delay, Hello, Manuel. We're almost done with like base Sapienza, vanilla Sapienza. Sure. Then we get to do the sweet. Um, <clears throat> the idol mission, Sexy voice. which is in Sapienza, but it's set at a different time. So there's a film crew here making a movie, and you've got to assassinate the star of the movie. And then there's another one where there's like a political rally going on here, and you've got to assassinate the political guy. But it changes the town, and it kind of changes how the town works, so it's pretty good. I'm pretty good, Manuel. Pretty good. Right, this guy better go and uh, stand at the well, because we're going to push him in. We're currently making a contract, because there's no way to accomplish some of the challenges, unless you make a custom contract. It's total BS, but it's true. So we have to make a contract, and then we have to do our own contract. For example, you have to kill a target by pushing them in the well. Where's he going? He's taking a really weird route. Like, you have to make a contract by pushing someone in the well, but none of your targets ever go to a place where you could push them in the well. There's no way to manipulate them there. Unless you threw like a hundred coins. Where is this guy going? He'd better be going to the well. Unless you threw like a hundred coins and killed everyone else in the level so only they would pick up the coins and you could get them to go and stand by the well. That'd be the only way. Because you can't just KO them and dump them in the well either. You have to actually push them in. So, we have to make a custom level. Which is exactly what we're doing. He's going to go and stand by that well. We'll push him in. Jobs are good. Sorry guys. Knock them out and put them in the well. Doesn't work, right? Doesn't work. Doesn't count as pushing them in. Okay. I'd love to make some real contracts at some point.
<clears throat> they should make new maps and stories. Um, yeah, I guess so. I mean, they'll be focusing on Hitman 3 now, right? I assume. Right, we need to get our outfit. Should be easy enough. Got our outfit. We have to kill two as Luigi and two as Mario. <clears throat> have I noticed the evil deer are reporting my crime to the police? <laughs> Which evil deer? Oh, in GTA? No? Is that true? I haven't played GTA in years. <clears throat> right, this should be a nice easy double kill. Wow, he gives zero shits. <clears throat> okay. Now... Uh, we go and get the Mario outfit. We kill his two targets, and then we push the detective in the well. And that'll do two of our challenges for us. Hmm. I think Agent 47 should be able to run faster than this. He just goes for like a leisurely jog. He's supposed to be like a super trained badass assassin. You would think he would be able to sprint. It's part of the disguise. Well, yeah, true, but like when you've, um, well, potentially true. But once you've been seen, then, uh, you should be able to totally sprint, like, super, super fast. He's supposed to be, like, genetically enhanced. Sorry, Mario. He like practicing his voice acting. Good for business. He's like, got a really cool voice, and then when you nudge him, he's like, "Eh, are we gonna have a problem?" <clears throat> K. 
Come on. Now we just need to push that guy in the well. Saw another one at church today. One of the lab coats? Wait, did that not? Ah, it did. Cool. Jeez. About that lot with the Screwdriver can't do that. It can if it's wielded by 47. Whatever. Hey man, you do don't, this? Don't. Oh. Don't start, man. Hey, Dimwit, what, you got a learning disability? I said stop. I have stopped. Hold it. Well, that's just not fair. <clears throat> God damn. Command, how do you read? Over. Someone's knocking people's senses. Check all me. Somebody call for an ambulance. You gotta be kidding me. I just need a different outfit. Fine. I didn't hide the body, no, but I didn't expect the guy to freak out. It's fine, sort of. There we go, he's carrying on business as usual. <laughs> now we play the waiting game. The pros are here. Watch and learn. Yes, I understand. Yeah, you guys are real pros. Quick, quick, escape! Phew! That was close!
The bells. Need to kill three more targets with a sniper rifle. Assassinate three targets by drowning them. Disguise yourself as a red or green plumber. Assassinate five targets in an explosion. We're going to have to make a contract for that as well. <sighs> That's fine. That's fine. We can do that. Blow up five dudes? Sure. Starting location, the morgue. So we just need to KO five guys, drag them together, boom. Or just find a place where there's five people. But I think you're not allowed to get seen either, actually. Is that true? Might be true. It's not going to tell me. Pretty sure you're not allowed to get seen. I know I did just get seen, but that's fine because we're just creating the contract. One. Where's the best place to get five bodies going to be? We can do it in the sewer. Come on, priest. You're being added to the list. Unless... No, I can't get five people there in, in one. That's a shame. Child. Bomb in the church would have been quite efficient. Explosion around the clown. Ragar, you're a genius. <clears throat> Mario's gone rogue, he has. Doesn't it say you're not allowed to kill anyone else as well, though? I 
think it maybe says you're not allowed to kill anyone else. I can't see the challenge right now while I'm in the mission. I think it says you're not allowed to kill anyone else. <sighs> Which makes it a bit annoying. There's more than five people in the clown vicinity. Two more. Two more. God damn it. It must be somewhere nice that has exactly five people. <clears throat> Too awkward trying to group those guys together. Five people, five people. I mean, maybe if I threw it right, if I threw the bomb right. One, two, three, four. Wow, that barely killed anyone. Right, we'll look for the five people together. Maybe the cafe? Maybe the cafe. Saw another one at church today. One of the lab coats? I'm curious if I'm allowed to be seen, because if I am, it makes it much easier, because I can just KO a bunch of people. But if I'm not allowed to be seen, <clears throat> then it's awkward. I feel like the cafe is probably our best bet. Maybe not. Five people. Hmm. Five people is not going to be easy. Well, I can get. <clears throat> I can get three down here, then I just need two more. Getting two more is going to be tough though, so... You need somewhere... with a bunch of people who are really easy to knock out. Five, five. 
in the pipe. Five by five. That only kills four. I need to see what the requirements are for this mission. It's very important. Only eliminate targets. Any accident explosion. Got to be an accident explosion. I mean, I guess that's fine. But okay. Fair enough. No, <clears throat> oh, I didn't mean to do that. An accident explosion. Interesting. An accident, an accident. So... We have to be dressed as a plumber. So it has to be somewhere where the plumbers are allowed to go. Accident explosions might explode more than the ICA bomb. Yeah, true, true. That's the kind of positive attitude I'm looking for. But we're allowed to be seen, so it's fine. <laughs> it was an accident.
Good, good. <clears throat> Shit, which one is it? This one. <clears throat> right. This shouldn't be too bad. Unless the people who we want move around, which they almost certainly will do. But that's fine, we'll get them. Let's get our outfit. No, wait, he's down here. Yeah. Thank you. Right, now we just need to group those five guys up next to a truck. Another one at church today. One of the lab coats? Please don't breathe right in my face. Enough with the joke, Paul! They'll be back. <clears throat> Only eliminate targets. Ah, uh... I knew shooting that guy was a bad idea. We're killing Leonardo Corleone. Right, I'm actually going to go and get them first. Don't you dare.
You guys are really lucky I'm not allowed to kill anyone. See an opportunity, you have to take it. Anyone else? Don't you dare! <clears throat> You son of a bitch. The bald asshole's in the alleyway. Don't Please. <sighs> you who Stellar job, buddy. Stellar job. You drop the body now. All right, all right, nice and slow. See, you're messing with the wrong guy, pal. I got paramilitary training. How's that paramilitary training working out for you? Good. No one else is coming to interfere. I need your clothes. Let's go get our Mario outfit. Hopefully nobody comes and interferes in the meantime. Including you, bench lady. Don't even think about it. I swear, if I get back and someone's woken them up, I'm not going to be happy. I'm not going to be happy.
Oh, Mario! Thank you. <clears throat> what? Don't worry about it. Oh my god, someone found them. Right. Please work. Please work. You're a bit too close for comfort. Really? Did I seriously find the one bike that doesn't... Never mind. Thought it wasn't going to explode for a sec. That guy was like, I have reason to believe it was not an accident. The game explicitly called it an accident explosion. What more do they want? I'm not going to lie, we might have to do another contract. That was nice. Wasn't the cleanest, but it got the job done. So all we've got left is... Kill someone with the church bell. We'll do a contract for that because it'll be super easy. Last night, 10 targets with a sniper rifle. I guess we're doing a contract for that. We only need to kill three more, so we'll just do a sniper contract and just snipe three random guys. <clears throat> Drown three people. And none of those can be done without doing a contract. Well, drop a bell on someone can, but if we're doing a contract anyway, then sod it. Uh, we need a sniper rifle. Snipe three people from the bell tower, then drop the bell on someone. Jeremy, that is a great idea.
Uh, we'll get the pickup from... Let's get it from the safe house. We'll start in the safe house. And I will be right back. Right. Maybe we just snipe three people from here. Sod it. We're already here. We've got the sniper rifle. Nice and easy. And then, just uh, drop a bell on someone. Probably the priest. <clears throat> Whoever comes and gets it is getting a bell dropped on the head. Unlucky, dude. <clears throat> I guess you could say he lost his life to a coin toss. Rest in peace. Missing crowbar. Look, ain't got time for no missing crowbar. And then, we do have to do another contract after this, because we have to drown three people.
And unfortunately, I think kicking them in the ocean doesn't count as drowning. Even though it totally should. <laughs> you bastard! I'm sorry, Fabiano Graziani. <laughs> now we just need to kill Massimiliano Scanarotti. Sir, uh, you can't go in there. I'm son of a. You can't just walk around and knock me. Hey, uh, uh. I bet I can. What the hell? Are you alright? Stop doing that. That's evil, man. Shut up, uh, priest. They forced my hand. That's right, chase me, don't wake him up. Got no visual. Oh, thank you. Don't take me out. What percentage completion am I at? For Sapienza? It's a good question. Thank you. Fifty five per cent, which sounds worse than it is. Ooh, look at that. We got a silenced one. Silent sniper rifle. Mm. 
<clears throat> I'm happy with that. Because now, in Sapienza, a world of tomorrow, the only thing we've got left, apart from the classics, which we can't do, is disguise yourself as a plumber and drown three people. Hey, Rifi! When you did these ones, did you just do it via a contract? <clears throat> yeah. Yeah. It's the only way, right? It's actually the only way. Right, we need to drown three people, so let's bring... Our emetic, and then we'll have to find two more. Which is a bit annoying. <sighs> I was hoping kicking people in the ocean counted as drowning, but I don't think it does. Mind me. Hey. One poison. I think there's another one down here. Maybe. No, there's a key to the town hall, though. I wish you could set the difficulty in the amount of sage you're allowed on contracts. Yeah, that'd be nice, wouldn't it? Right, we need one more poison. Take safety's off. You're gonna be like that, man. Wow, that guy just was totally unfazed by that. We need one more poison. Hey, where are you? Have you got any rat poison? Rocco. I feel like you should have. Don't mind me. Hmm. No? Is there another poison? There's probably going to be one in the mansion, but I don't really want to go into the mansion. So there's probably one... I don't know. Uh, somewhere? It's a shame we don't have the uh, non... Ancient syringe, then we could have bought two syringes. Look at 
looking for poison. I thought there was two in the cafe, honestly, but... I'm a bit miffed that there wasn't. poison somewhere. I'm just looking for poison right now. Am I doing Austria, Singapore, and Siberia when I do all? Uh, all means all, so... <clears throat> all. I'm not sure which ones they are, but yeah. There must be another poison somewhere around here. Maybe I should just start. Oh, the sniper missions. Yeah, we'll be doing them. I love sniping. It's my favorite part of the game. Right, we'll start in the mansion. It's just going to make life easier. It's just going to make life easier. <clears throat> Thank you. <clears throat> Let's leave. Then we just need to find the three people we want to poison. One of them is going to be the psychiatrist for sure. Psychologist. The guy. <clears throat> Dr. Lafayette. Just because I hold a grudge. <coughs> and then we'll just find two other people who are drinking. Well, one other person who's drinking actually. Right, we need to get our Mario outfit. Which is actually going to be really annoying. Trying to poison them in the Mario outfit is going to be a right pain. But it's fine, I have a plan. I have a deviously fiendish, mischievous plan. Oh, Mario! And I think this is the last challenge we have to do for the stupid world of tomorrow. Do I have the clown outfit? Yes.
Maintenance. Hi. What? <laughs> right, we're going to steal another chef outfit. Doesn't even have to be a chef, really. It just has to be a kitchen assistant. Trigger that dialogue. He'll come and join us down here. You mind? Whoa, no, I don't mind. Okay? Go on then. It's Caruso. He's a bit eccentric. Well, you met him. Apparently, he's got trial to the wolf here. Who might believe his home? He's your I gave him the jibbity jab. Come on, man. Is he really just going to gimp out like that? This may have backfired. They had a little falling out. You're not going to throw up, are you? Right, Lafayette's getting marked. Who else drinks? That's what we care about, really. Who else drinks?
whole bunch of people drink. Um, Pretty sure they're legit. <clears throat> okay, people, you need to leave this area for your. Hey, man, I don't want trouble. What the? Hey. I guess we'll find out. I'm sure we can work with that. I'm sure we can work with it. Mm hmm. Yeah, it's a shame we haven't unlocked emetic poison. It'd also be nice to get a third poison, honestly, but I don't think we'll find one. Which means we'll have to use this manual jab, which is actually incredibly annoying. It is fine. Dressed as Luigi, it would have been much faster. Oh well. I'd love a third regular poison instead of this jab, honestly. Saw another one at church today. One of the lab coats?
I may have made a mistake. No, it's pretty unbelievable. Me, a mistake. <clears throat> Anyway, <clears throat> let's work on the assumption it's all going to be fine. Now this is going to be where it gets awkward. Good, good. Surrender. Look, don't worry about me. No! Why? Why would you do such a thing? It's not even going in. God damn it! Why would she? Oh. That could not be more annoying if it tried. What the? I'm getting help because you apparently have totally. Oh. Oh. If you're drowning them, you should be able to just do that, right? They're unconscious anyway, what difference does it make? That's really annoying. That's really annoying that she goes there. That's beyond annoying. There's literally a perfectly working toilet right there. Do you know what that means? I have to make a new contract.
At least I can optimize a little bit. We can get the Luigi outfit. Can I flood a sink and drown who investigates? Oh, I wish, Brian. I wish. That would be really nice. That'd be real nice. It's fine. This time, we're going to be totally fine. We know we can drown the doctor. Uh, we can also drown, I don't know, someone else. <laughs> the fact that she went and used the toilet, uh, went and used the, went and used the trash can when the toilet was right there has really thrown me off. It's really thrown me off. One. You just broke your wine glass, man. That was careless. Right. I should have brought a lockpick. I keep thinking to myself, remember to bring a lockpick. And then I always forget to bring a lockpick. <clears throat> Come on, buddy. Go inside. We can kill the doctor.
then we just need a third. I need to dress as Mario. Relock the door. Then we need a third who I'm not picking any of these guys. I don't trust that they'll use the toilet. The ideal would be one of the assassination targets, right? Because we know they use a toilet. Like the lady, what's her name? Should be the ideal one to do it to. I think that's what we do. It's the safest option. Maybe, sort of. Depending on your definition of safe. So I don't trust anyone else to go to a toilet. I just don't trust them. Yeah, I think there's a broken air con somewhere for you to fix. Just relax, you'll be on your way in a sec. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you're a good girl, thanks a lot. Oh, thank you. Right, we just need that guy's phone. We don't even need his outfit, we just need his phone. Well, no, we do need his outfit, actually, now that I think about it. They're gonna get pissy if I go through here, aren't they? I go this way. <clears throat> Is there anyone else I could poison easily? Not gonna like this. I thought she was going to be the easy option, god damn it. <clears throat> Fine. Someone. Someone. Someone who will drink and go to a toilet. She's the best option, I just need to get there as Mario, really. 
She really is the best option. Maybe the priest... I don't know if the priest will go to a toilet. I don't think he's got any toilets near him. I don't think he will. Is there anyone near here who drinks? Don't make it easy, huh? Someone who takes a drink. This is all we need. This is the last thing we need. To find someone who takes a drink and will use a toilet instead of a trash can. Ah. I'm gonna have to risk it on one of those guys. I don't want to, but I'm gonna have to. Anything else is too awkward. Like, I would just poison the lady, summon her to the golf thing and poison her there, but you can't get to the observatory as Mario. Let's see, let's see. I just don't trust any of them. Definitely not her. She's the one who screwed me. Yeah, how about you? Well, that's it. I'm betting it all on that guy. He left! The son of a bitch left. I can't catch a break. <laughs> He left. Please go and sit down again. Somebody drink out of that mug, please. I think those two will get up and leave and he'll come back. I think that's what's gonna happen. Better be what happens, because I'm losing the will to live.
please. Oh. They're leaving. Please, please. God damn it. Oh. No. They're all sitting at the wrong chair. Please, please. There he sat down again. We know that guy sits there. We know he does. Otherwise I wouldn't have poisoned that glass. It was that hat guy. Hopefully he goes and sits down now. Hopefully they leave and he goes, oh, I'll go sit down and have a drink. Now, please, let him use a toilet to be sick. That's all we need. Just use a toilet to be sick, please. I don't ask for much, game. I just want this guy to throw up in a toilet, not a trash can. Please, please, don't use the trash can. Don't use the trash can. If you use the trash can, I'm gonna cry. You! Oh, thank God! That clutch blocking of the trash can. Right. Now... We just need to do that again. <laughs> oh. But it's okay. We have a plan now. We just need to follow the plan through. We know the plan works. We know the plan works, we just need to... Why are only two people in the list? I didn't mark him.
I'm such an idiot. I am such an idiot. But it's fine. We just need to make the contract. We don't need to do it cleanly. But I am an idiot. We know who we're killing. If you get in the bin first, they would probably use the toilet every time. Yeah, maybe. Maybe. Hopefully. I need to remake that contract. But... We don't need to kill them with what we're going to kill them with, so we'll just put bullets in their heads. <clears throat> we know who we're doing it to. Lafayette, this guy at the beginning on the corner, and the guy with the hat. I'm hoping getting to the bin first does make them use the toilet every time, honestly, otherwise... I don't like the idea of there being RNG involved. So, we know we're killing this guy. And we know we're killing Lafayette. And because it worked, and I know it worked, we're killing Hatman. Right. This is going to be the one. We need our emetic. We don't need smuggled. But we need to start as a chef. This is it. This is the one. The final moment. Grab the poison. Hey, is there on? Grab the outfit. Poison this dude. Sorry, buddy.
I didn't bring a lockpick again. But it's fine, we don't need one. But it is annoying that I keep forgetting one. <laughs> this guy's gonna come out for a smoke. He will do once he's done whatever he's doing up there. I'm not letting him go for a smoke. Okay. What? Yoink. Totally disoriented myself. Right, cool. I would poison them both at once, but I know that's just me being impatient, and then their pathing might mess up. I need to switch to Mario. Shit. You ain't checking shit. Do I feel like I'm cursed? Sometimes I think I'm cursed. Oh my god, he's being sick! Go, go, go!
under arrest. Put those hands up. No sudden moves. What? You gotta help me! Target you took gotta one. Help me! I'll be right back. It's all going according to plan. I know it might not look like it is, but I swear it's all going according to plan. I've had enough. Lafayette is gonna drink this poison. So help me God. Chill out, Lafayette. Calm down. Why don't you have a drink to settle your nerves? There we go, calm down. 
You were just thinking, do hitmen fall under the serial killer moniker? I think they do. They just have a different motivation. <coughs> their technique of choosing their victims is all that differs, right? Everyone will calm down eventually. They'll never think to look in the town hall. You reckon you can get that weapon? No. Calm down, everyone. I know the town's dead, but Lafayette just needs a coffee. What's he doing? Look, everyone's getting back to business as usual. Lafayette, go and have your drink. <coughs> I think he's seen a gun. Was it the motivation that makes a serial killer or just the fact of multiple murders? <coughs> Um, it's just the multiple murders, I think. <clears throat> multiple murders over a prolonged period of time. If it's multiple murders at once, I don't think it counts. I think it's got to be over a pro prolonged period of time. If it's coffee and he doesn't want it, you'll take it, even if it's poisoned. Come on, Lafayette, looks like he's chilled out. I swear, if he doesn't come back. Lafayette. He's walking off into the sunset. Where's he going? Oh, was he going to get a guard? Please tell me he was going to get a guard. <clears throat> if it's cyanide, at least you'll have nice almond tasting coffee. Yeah, that's true. Come on, Lafayette. Go for a drink. Stop being so diligent with reporting stuff. Where's he going? Is he going to do the frickin' therapy? Oh my god, I think he's going to do the therapy. Are you shitting me? I tried to get him to do that for ages. No, he's coming back. He was uh, going to get a guard. 
Lafayette, just have a drink, man. Just have a drink. All at once makes you a mass murderer. Yeah, totally. <coughs> Come on, Lafayette. Drown your sorrows. Uh huh. Uh huh. Sit down. Uh huh. Uh huh. Bottoms up. Ah, you dumb son of a bitch! Oh, oh, what's wrong? What's wrong? You're not feeling good. Ah, oh. just uh, don't be sick in a trash can. Don't be sick in a trash can. Oh my god, is he going to see the multiple corpses there and freak out? Lafayette, don't get freaked out by the corpses, man. Don't get freaked out by the corpses. Yes! This is for Lafayette. I also love how uh, nonchalant he is about the bodies, but... He's like totally stable, like mentally. He'd handle it best. Better than anyone else, I think. Except 47, who handles it like a boss. But Lafayette would come close second. You lucky bastard! <coughs> nice! And I think that means we're done with standard Sapienza. <clears throat> we unlocked a hammer. Great. Now for Sapienza Advanced. Exactly! Now for cool Sapienza. Actually, we're not done. We're not done. I'm sorry. I'm sorry to hype it up like that. We're not done. We actually have one thing we have to do that I haven't done yet. 
Hostile environment mission story. I apologize. Shouldn't be hard. We don't need to finish the level. We just need to <clears throat> go through the motions, whatever the motions are. Ethos Field Lab, you made it. The virus prototype will be close by. Look for some type of quarantine unit. The goal is... It doesn't actually tell us. We need to know where to trigger the... Um... Where to trigger the mission story. Maybe we trigger it in here. Are they going to talk? Oh look, you could conceal a bomb in here. That'd be a smart way of doing it. There must be something somewhere. Poison the rats. Why would you poison the rats? Come on guys, I need the mission story. Probably sexually harass someone, it says hostile environment. Yeah! Somewhere, there must be a clue. Someone will be having a discussion, like, ooh, did you see little Timmy? He was saying, definitely don't do this or the virus will die. Adding in a... <coughs> Adding in a... what does that say? Adding in a... Uh, sir, uh, I don't mean to be disrespectful, but... You are being disrespectful. Somewhere there's going to be a discussion. See, this isn't it, otherwise it'd pop up a thing saying mission story. Someone is going to be having a discussion that will tell us what we need to do. Let's kill everyone in the lab. Yeah, you can actually do that, it's pretty good. <clears throat> and then you can uh, cause the guards to run in there, and they all run in and just instantly die. And it's like an infinite loop of dying guards. It's pretty fantastic. Hey, come on, come on. 
Get up. Get out of here. Could you come? Take him out! Uh I wonder how you start that mission story. I wonder how you start it. I wonder how you start it. I'm just gonna Google where it starts because otherwise I'll be roaming the world. Um. <clears throat> Just walking around the world looking for a conversation. Yeah, but just going through the steps doesn't always do it. Like with the flower one. I went through all the steps and uh, it didn't work. Ethos Field Lab. You made it. The virus prototype will be close by. Look for some type of quarantine unit. <laughs> What's it called? I just need to know where it begins. Hostile environment. Sapienza hostile environment. I just need to know where it begins. Wow, that's literally zero information. Where is this opportunity activated? <clears throat> in the lab, from the clipboard in front of the big computer. Clipboard in front of the big computer. <clears throat> in the lab... <clears throat> Toxic environment. Can I help you? I don't see a clipboard. Sir, sir, uh, you you really shouldn't be here. You shouldn't be anywhere near here. <coughs> Clipboard in front of the big computer. Look, I'm just looking for a clipboard. Chill out, guys. There it is. <clears throat> the lab <clears throat> mission story completed Sorry guys. So I think we're done. Um Yeah. <clears throat> Which means, I think we're done with Crappienza. I actually quite like Sapienza, but 
It sure has dragged on. <clears throat> so the only things here that aren't done are the classics, and they can't be done. Because they are multi-level objectives. <clears throat> Which means now, we get to move on to the Icon. I'll play the briefing. Good morning, 47. Your destination is the Italian coastal town of Sapienza, where our client, La Ventura Pictures, is shooting a superhero epic based on the cult graphic novel, The Icon. Your target is Dino Bosco, the film's director and leading man. A washed up character actor, Bosco sees the icon as his big comeback. Unfortunately, his rampant perfectionism and complete disregard for the budget has left Laventura on the verge of bankruptcy. Still, he doggedly refuses to wrap the production. Laventura cannot fire Bosco without violating the contract. That is why they have asked us to retire him before the whole studio goes belly up. I will leave you to prepare. Okay. We've got ten assassinations. Three discoveries, but we've already done one of them. Escape in the car, disguise yourself as a crew member. Easy. <clears throat> Complete the mission stories. Assassinate him. And silent assassin suit only is what we're going to try. Which means, what should we bring? What should we bring? Silent Assassin suit only. Um. Quite like flash phone. We'll bring a lock pick. <clears throat> Okay, <clears throat> so we need to find a way to kill him without changing our outfit or being seen. Welcome to Sapienza 47. Today's shoot is already in progress. For the sake of authenticity, Dino Bosco's icon costume is genuinely bulletproof. He does, however, insist on doing his own stunts. So, I suggest you take advantage of Murphy's Law. Good luck, 47. Sniper. You can't do a uh, sound assassin suit only with a sniper. Because they find the body. <coughs> Otherwise, I would totally be sniping him. Do you know Bosco? Icon. Make his stunt go bad, yeah. I'm not following a mission story guide. If we can figure it out ourselves, I will. According to the film crew, the prop robot suspended above the set has dangerous teeth. Sir, this is a restricted area. I'm sorry, man. It should, uh, in my opinion, in my humble opinion. Welcome to. The map should color code where you're not allowed to go. <clears throat> Wouldn't be hard. 
Just have it a different colour if you're not allowed to go in there. The teeth, the teeth. <clears throat> right, let's snoop around. Explosives rigged? Yeah, good and ready. But if we go manual, it'd be so much better. That way we can trigger the explosions to his cue, you know, which changes every time. Uh, maybe. But we need to make sure the explosions will happen. Automatic or manual trigger. I don't care. Got it? Oh yeah, crystal clear. Mm-hmm. Man like Bosco. Yeah, that's not gonna work, buddy. Can't let you through. So happy. Hmm. We need to wait into the set. <clears throat> Way onto the set. It's a much smaller map, which is nice. <clears throat> it's got a lot of areas blocked off. Do you think this film will be any good? Hey, did the Hello, new fuel sir. Be here yet? You can't yeah, just come waltzing through here. That's strong stuff. I want to test it before I use it here on uh, old Ed. Uh, why? Well, it's kind of cheap, but really potent. You can make the whole thing blow up. Set fire to everything oh, around it, not handled it's correctly. so shiny. Look, it's just Isn't a safety cool? precaution. Okay, got it. That makes sense. Don't want to prolong this production any more than needed, uh, right? Yeah, right. All right, I'll see you. Hmm. Hmm. How can I get in there? Pretty well guarded, to be honest. More guarded than uh, that guy was. Hmm. Please turn around. I need to find the camera system as well. How can we get in there? Welcome to so many films, films that have actually been finished and released while we still been shooting. Yeah. Do you reckon this is before or after that guy died? Chronologically. Oh, I'm sorry, man. This trespassing is brutal. Why can't it just tell me on the map where I'm not allowed to go? Welcome to. 
You literally step one foot in there and it's like, well, no more Silent Assassin for you. You can dress up like the people in red by the van. Yeah, but we're trying to do a um, Silent Assassin suit only, which means we're not allowed to dress up. Sorry, sir, I can't let you through. Got my orders. Worst guard ever. Okay, I feel like that doesn't actually help me. But, <clears throat> maybe it does? Sure hope nobody patrols this way. Oh my god, I'm such an idiot. Maybe if I get in here. What if I go up here? Help! <clears throat> Maybe. <clears throat> what about Stoner Guy's room? Maybe? Stoner guy. Hmm. What if I go even higher up? We have a security breach, so don't worry, the pros are here. Watch and learn. Yes, I understand. Please, got please, to please. You, you gotta help. I think it's a weapon. Oh my god, I'm glad to see you. Please, you gotta come and help. Where is he? Please, you need to leave now for your own In the... Okay, okay, got it, got it, sir. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. This 
Hmm. Cool, it's gonna be tricky to get in there. Maybe I don't have to get in there. Maybe I don't have to get in there. Maybe I have to... I feel like I do have to get in there if I'm gonna Welcome kill him. To... Or I need to get him to come out of there. They're my two options, really. We found our way in, that was actually quite easy. <clears throat> and there he is. He's bulletproof, do you reckon he's wrench proof? He's wrench proof. I don't know where I'm going anymore. I've gone crazy. I've gone off the plot. But I haven't been seen! Missing a screwdriver. No! Really? Right, find a screwdriver and then do that. <clears throat> Welcome to a screwdriver. That's plausible. I can just find a screwdriver. There's probably one lying about somewhere. Action. Also, if I'm real quick, can I... Some rat poison. If he has a drink. Got my screwdriver! Is there anything else I can do here, though? Dunno. I 
Right. Two rat poisons. Hold down. This place is overflowing in rat poison. <laughs> At least these guys don't snitch when I jump over here. What's that actually going to do? Because he doesn't actually hit this thing, right? I feel like I'm also going to have to mess with the ramp. Which makes this potentially unworkable as a plan. I don't know how I'd mess with the ramp. There is the ramp. There was that control panel. There was a control panel down there. I didn't look what it did. Can I? No, I can't. Can't get anywhere else from up here. Alright, I need that guy to move. Hello. There's a screwdriver right there, that's good to know. What's this all about? We're making progress. Sketchy, sketchy progress, but it is progress. Interesting.
Easy does it. Is that more rat poison? Unlock fuel storage. Pick up high octane fuel. Octane fuel could be highly unstable, be careful when handling it. Maybe it could be used for a kind of grand finale. So what, I'd need to put that somewhere? But where? So who's he talking to when it comes to the air ramp? I feel like that's what we need. Progress. That's what this is. Progress. No, just go, go. No, go, go. Just, just action. Yeah, we need to improve the ramp. Or we need to change the explosives. Or I need to lure him here using a coin. Oh my god, he fell for it! Oh my god, he's an idiot. See an opportunity, you gotta take it. That's the Hitman way. Sorry, buddy. Target down. Now head towards an exit. <clears throat> The system works. Done. Nice. <clears throat> I will take that. I'm pretty pleased with that. Right, now we can uh, <clears throat> start using outfits and stuff and really start 
figuring this stuff out. Welcome to First up, let's get an outfit. <clears throat> That didn't really work. Maybe let's not go quite so crazy. Welcome to. Right, I'm gonna get a drink. I'll be right back. I am back. <laughs> Brian says, you need to get Dino's, Dino's outfit after you kill him and finish the movie. Totally. 47 can become the new hit action star. Sir, you're trespassing. Please turn around, sir. Hey, you. This is a restricted area. Oh, I'm Did sorry, I man. Make myself clear. Come here. Yeah, I didn't realize. <clears throat>
Fuel case key. Yoink. Right, now we should be able to walk around relatively freely. Right, let's look around. Let's snoop. Snooping as usual. First of all, what was this? Manual detonation, pyrotechnics. <clears throat> okay, that's pyrotechnics. But we need to replace the actual fuel. Where would we do that? Hey, Dino. Are we rolling? You have to tell me. Fight. Action. Zygon. Jesus. Oh, the flame can actually kill us. Good to know. Makes a lot of sense, but good to know. Welcome to Sapienza 47. Today's shoot is already in progress. For the sake of authenticity, Dino Bosco's icon costume is genuinely bulletproof. He does, however, insist on doing his own stunts. So, I suggest you take advantage of Murphy's Law. Good luck, 47. <laughs> Mm-hmm. Right. So, don't run into the dino flames. The alien flames. Right, let's get that uh, mechanic outfit that Brian was talking about. Mechanic in red is dancing with me. Cheek to cheek. Explosives rigged. Yeah, good and ready. Wait, that's just a kitchen outfit. Look, I know, man. I know I'm not part of the crew. Just come here and we can talk it out. Idiot. Um... I would like one of those red outfits. This whole debacle in can. So at the premiere in Rome, Dino sees the film for the first time and he's he's freaking furious. Oh god, I don't like where this is going. <laughs> the producers had recut it, you know? It was horrible. And so Bosco's called up on the stage, right? And at this point, he's fucking livid. So he, uh, he has to justify this piece of shit, so he takes a leak on the screen in front of everyone, flips him the bird, and storms off the stage. I heard about that. Guess that's what ruined his career. Hey, 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 hey. Don't talk about your boss like that. He pays the rent. Yeah! Don't talk about your boss like that.
Anyway. <laughs> Who found the body? Oh, it was the other body. Okay, that's fine. Right, this guy says the red outfit. Nice, nice. Let's get some of this special fuel. I'm not sure what we do with this fuel. Presumably we need to put it somewhere. Oh my god, these guys are the worst. You know what? I'm changing back. Ah, oh, there was a computer somewhere around here. This one. What is it? Increase pressure on the air ramp. Ah! Have I got a screwdriver? No, but I can get one, right? Then we increase the pressure. And then he gets eaten by the machine. Sod off, security guard, please. Yoink. Sabotage, sabotage. Question. Hmm. Okay. <clears throat> Sod off, security guard. You're really messing with my zen. Just leave. Make like a tree and leave. Look, security guard, don't start. I just want to watch him kill himself. Don't start, man. I want to see him kill himself. Uh-huh. 
What? I increased the pressure. Did they turn it down again? Oh my god, those sons of bitches. I bet they turned it down again. <clears throat> bet they turned the goddamn pressure down again. Ah. There's no justice in the world. These sons of bitches. Are you sure? Okay, we're about to start shooting. I don't want to have to come look for you, okay? Stay focused, people. Hey, would you off, dude. Stop that Very nice. I'll take that. <clears throat> so you totally could do that one as your silent assassin. If I hadn't got that coin. Because you can get to that area and you could hide there. Um, that'd be a good way to get your silent assassin suit only. It counts as an accident. Pretty happy with that. <clears throat> nice. <clears throat> We've done one of the mission stories. Something to chew on. Now, an explosive ending. Time to meet the fans and light my fire. In terms of challenges, assassinate a target with a headshot. That's gonna have to be a sniper one then. Right? Is there a... There's no sniper one for this. Interrupt the shoot. Complete four assassination challenges. Yeah, that's fine. Drown him. Poison him. Set him on fire. Kill him with a gas lamp. Kill him in pyrotechnics. So some of these we'll get through doing those... Ooh, escaping this car. I'd love to do that one. Um, right. Do we have any other starting locations? No. I'll bring a lethal, lethal poison vial, just because. There is one which is poison him. Welcome to... And I would love to poison him. See, look, if I can poison that. Wait, 
I want to do it as the mission story. Which means I need to... If I can be a chef... Oh, I didn't bring a lockpick. Are you serious? <laughs> Maybe I can poison it? I'm sorry, man. I didn't mean to get my gun out. I didn't mean to get my gun out. Oh my god. Whoops. <laughs> Welcome to. Do you ever just accidentally whip out a weapon? That's good though. That lets us poison him. <laughs> and then we need to somehow get him off the chute. <clears throat> Don't look down there, cop. Right, I just need to somehow help they get the pressure right this time. You can't sir, you cannot enter these premises. Good. That's the way out. Stay focused, people. Mm-hmm. How am I gonna cancel the shoot? Add a picture of something. Maybe I can just like destroy a bit of the equipment. What was the bit of equipment that it could it could see? It was like it was that. Oh, it worked! Maybe. It gave me a challenge anyway. Time to meet the fans. Is he actually going to go meet the fans? And then get poisoned? Or is he just going to stand there like an asshole? I feel like he's not meeting the fans. Maybe he will once the search is off. Bosco! It's 
It's probably because they're still searching. Once they stop searching, he'll probably... Go and meet the fans? Maybe? Not sure where they're searching, though. Oh, right, because uh, they found that body. Come on, man. Stop just standing there like a douchebag. Right, I think they're chilling out. Yeah, that's right. Get rid of that guy's corpse. They're still searching, apparently. Don't know why. There we go, they're not searching anymore. Is he gonna move? Please move. He's supposed to go meet the fans. Don't panic, everything's under control. <laughs> Don't panic, everything's under control as he drags a body through the stage. Everything's totally normal. He's actually refusing to move. Power of the coin! I just had to get him out of his mental block. Good, good. Let's go check out the Q&A. <clears throat> <clears throat> Stellar job tidying up that corpse, guys. Much appreciated. Is he coming? Look, we don't need any cooks messing with stuff here, so you're not coming through. He's a ghost. What the hell? He's a ghost. <clears throat> Is that those bloody kids messing around again? What? You're not allowed through there, dude. Oh, I see. One rule for them, a different rule for me. You're not allowed through there, civilian. Come on, guard, do your job. Double thumbs up, man. Yeah. That guard is a son of a bitch. Oh, I hope that's not her drink. Thank you all for coming. I'm so sorry about the wait, but as you might have guessed, Mr. Bosco is a perfectionist. But the time has come, and Mr. Bosco will answer all of your questions very shortly. Ooh. Thank you. See when they say shortly. Come on, Bosco. Oh, 
Go Dino! Look, everyone's standing in this crowd. Don't be a douche. I spill my drink. Now head towards an exit. Did that count as the mission story? Sierra Niner, get someone to send an ambulance ASAP. There's been an accident. Don't know, Command. I don't know that either, Command. I just got. Oh my God! Someone killed him. Right, I want his car. I'm assuming I can get the key to his car from in his trailer. And I just run into his trailer while everyone's busy. No, I don't have the key. Still. Okay, I'm trying one more time, sir. You need to follow me right now. Not a hippie, commie, pinko, queer. I'm just Agent 47. And I stole his car keys. Hey guys, have you seen that guy? Whew! Nice car, yeah. Oh, yeah. I don't think it gave me the mission story, which I'm a bit miffed about. Oh, maybe it did. Maybe it did. Two out of four. It did. Cool. Um, Firewire, headshot, drown them, set them on fire, gas lamp. Gas lamp's alright, we just have to do the same thing, basically. Sort of. <clears throat> so we don't need the poison anymore. Um. Ooh, we got breaching charges. Nice. <clears throat> Relatively quiet. I mean, I feel like a lockpick's just better. I would like to smuggle a sniper rifle, please. We're gonna headshot him. Welcome to <clears throat> Where is the danger? I mean, that thing looks like it wanted to light a cigarette. I mean, seriously. I mean, seriously. This guy's annoying. Most useless security system ever. He said it was here, right? Maybe it's upstairs? I don't know. It said it was here.
Where is it? Hmm. Maybe it's downstairs. Yeah, it's down here. Okay, cool. <clears throat> Put a bullet through his hand. There's a pretty nice area up here. Three shots. Wait, did I have to headshot him? <clears throat> headshot, huh? Okay. I thought I'd just had to shoot him, but it makes a lot of sense that it's a headshot. Welcome to Makes a whole lot of sense that it's a headshot. At least I know where the uh, where the gun is now. Come on. Picky picky. Needs to be a headshot. Then, uh. Headshot it will be. I'm sure I got him with a headshot last time. Really? Wow, great. I don't want to do this, man. Look, it's just a toy sniper rifle. That's what it is. It's not a real sniper rifle. That would be crazy. <laughs> you can 
do it, 47. I guess you can't do it, 47. But you know what? That's totally fine, because we still got the challenge. Two headshots, or three body shots to kill him. Not too shabby. Welcome to... Right, let's do the other mission stories. We need to figure out what to do with that explosive. <clears throat> I've had to say no to so many films. Films that have... Ouch! Ow! Ah! <laughs> right. <clears throat> Explosives. Let's get the key. Then we can get the fuel. I don't know where we put the fuel. Not sure where we put the fuel. Explosives rigged? Yeah, good and ready. But if we go manual, it'd be so much better. Film crew, huh? Who is this? Wow, he literally gave no shits about that. What the hell? Right, what do I do with this improved fuel? Maybe I put it in the robot somehow? Target lockdown. No, no, no. You don't need no lockdown. I know there's a bunch of corpses, but you don't need to lock down over it. God damn it. <clears throat> These guys are a bunch of oversensitive jerks. I didn't even bring my, uh, what you call it. Fiber wire. It's fine. He'll calm down. Soon enough, he'll calm down. They always do. Look, he's just texting, right? He's really dedicated if he keeps going after finding like five of his guys shot in the face. Really, really dedicated. Please move away. Who said that? Right, hopefully he gets burnt to a crisp by that new high-octane fuel.
Rest in peace, Bosco. Dino's Inferno. That's good. It's a nice name. <clears throat> good. So we've only got one left, which is an explosive ending. Welcome to Not sure how that works. I assume it's got something to do with that manual detonator that we saw. Where's the danger? This guy's a real whiner. Need one of those explosive uniforms. Listen, buddy. I don't want to kill you. And you don't want to die. So how about you just ignore the fact that I'm going to pick this lock? <laughs> Identify yourself. That's enough. Fine, I'll leave. Hey, stand right there. On lighter You guys were warned. No one can say you weren't warned. I just want to take out the red guys who are controlling those explosions. This is so exciting, she says. Uh-uh. 
<clears throat> so you're gonna get rid of the body. Enabled manual, what does that do for me? Do I actually need like an explosive? Like a detonator. I assume I need a detonator? Activate the remote detonator, so I need a remote detonator. If I was a remote detonator, where would I be? In a truck? In here? Yoink. Right, I'm not sure when I need to detonate it. So let's save. <clears throat> He's gonna whine about the frames again. Come on! So they explode. Where do they explode? I didn't actually pay attention. Okay. No, don't action yet. Okay. So I just need to time it when he's going through the portal. That should be all right. Maybe. Come on, Bosco. I know I'm probably going to get it wrong, so let's save again. I don't want to go through his come on every time. See, I knew I'd whiff. There's one thing I know. It's the fact that I always whiff. Turns out it's really lenient, unless you're too late. Uh, did that get us the mission story? 
No. God damn it. Right, we need to actually find the mission story so we can track it. Welcome to. That should have got us it. We killed him with the explosion. Maybe the fact that I mass murdered everyone uh, ruined it. Come on. Right, they they talk about it down here, right? Oh, it sure would be great to use the manual trigger. Explosives rigged, death, good and ready. But if we go manual, it'd be so much better. That way we can trigger the explosions to his cue, you know, which changes every time. Uh, maybe, but we need to make sure the explosions will happen. Autumn. Um, follow. Automatic or manual trigger. I don't care. Got it? Oh, yeah. Sir, this is a restricted so area. Shiny. I feel like that should have, uh... That should have triggered it, right? They're talking about the new fuel. Those guys talk about the explosions. I was listening to them talk about the explosions, but it didn't didn't give me the thing. Does someone else talk about explosions? I feel like they're the only ones talking about explosions. Is it who talks about the explosives? Sorry. Hey, you. You're coming with me. Understood? Yeah, I understand. That's right, mister. You just keep walking and remain calm. Mm-hmm. Looking good, sir. All right, I'm not going to be bothering you no more, sir. Good, good. <clears throat> Right. Sir, you need clearance to pass through. It's an icon. Sir, this is off limits. Sir, I'm not sure I know who you are. Who does this guy think he is? Try 
No, don't shoot. Why they gotta shoot? Why well, you gotta escalate the situation, man? Why you got to escalate? She's in storage. Ah. I just wanted to kill Dino Bosco. Now you guys are throwing away your lives. It's frankly upsetting. Come on, guys. Pretty sure I just killed every security guard there is, so... You know. Maybe you guys should treat me with respect. <clears throat> Mission story guide updated. Really? Oh, is he going to do the Q&A? Maybe. I feel like I just murdered every single security guard on this level. In one go. Hey lady, how are you doing? Left one alive. Command. <laughs> He's got one more, huh? I guess they're still one because they're still searching. Where's there still a guard? 
Oh God! Is that what I needed? A code to manually override the automatic explosions. That's kind of dumb. It let me do it without the code. It let me do it without the code. See, look, I've got two of the mission story guides now. Wait, an explosive ending. Mission story completed. What? I didn't do it. Yeah, whatever. If it says it's done, I'm happy with that. Right, assassinate him with the fiber wire. Drown him. Kill him with a gas lamp explosion. Complete all mission stories. Complete four assassination challenges. I mean, we've done five, so what's it talking about? Um... Yeah, so what we've got left is gas lamp, drown, fiber wire. Apparently. So let's gas lamp him. There's no security left, so let's do it, right? Oh, Bosco! Actually, is there any rat poison kicking about? Look, Bosco, you need to chill out, man. I think he's only got one guard left, and it's that guy over... Somewhere. Yeah, the guy down here who refuses to move. That guy. I think that's the last security guard. Oh, he left. Awesome. I wonder if once I kill him, will they even be able to go into lockdown? That'll be pretty great if they can't. Where is he? Some guy ran asking for help. Ah! Get away. Got it. Yeah, get away. Central, I'm reading you five by five. Uh, area is clear. Proceeding to the next location. Out. I am not gonna die. Holy fuck it! Get out of my way. Oh my god. Mm-hmm. Come 
Don't worry, Bosco. I've got your back. Don't worry, Bosco. Your best security squad is on the job. Bosco, do you know that I'm a traitor? Is that what's going on? I was pretty sure I hid that from you pretty well. Fair enough. Okay, Bosco, here's the deal. I will... Not be too much of a douchebag. All I want to do is destroy your lighting setup. Preferably without um, anyone seeing me do it. Hey, you! Answer me when I'm talking to you. What? Hey you! Let me yeah? see your face! You don't wanna do this, man. You don't wanna do this. You're not one of the bodyguards. I hate to burst your bubble, but you look like a real jerk off in that. Oh! <laughs> Look guys, I was willing to play nice. Bosco is going to do this Q&A session. Run. We're getting this Q&A session. Perfect crime. Right. Hey, Bosco. How's it going, man? You want to calm down and uh, go and do that Q and A session? Once it does a Q&A session, then uh, we can do everything except the fiber wire. And that's going to be great. Yeah, yeah, everyone's freaking out. There's no security left. They should just accept their place in life. Like Bosco. He's chilling out. He's just on his phone. This is indeed still Sapienza. <clears throat> now, the fact that my solution to most problems is murder everyone is probably Back. slowing us down. Huh. 
See? Back to work. Okay, I think that was it. Time to make a movie. <laughs> Come on, guys. You heard him. Time to make a movie. Come on, Bosco. You said it yourself. Time to make a movie, man. He's found a glitch in the Matrix. He's about to transcend reality. <laughs> but half the crew is dead. Did I fucking stutter? <laughs> totally. He's gonna become Neo. gonna realize he's in a game. Come on Bosco, chill out. Okay, usually when they freak out like this, the best thing you can do is throw a coin. Coin not working, no? Come on man, usually the coin's pretty good. Usually you're well up for a little coin trick. Come on, Bosco! He's in deep if he doesn't like coins anymore. Yeah, totally. What if I set off the pyrotechnics? Does he not care? Bosco! You gotta chill out, man! I'm sorry that I murdered every single security guard in this one room. I'm sorry. But you gotta get over it. Fine, I'm taking my coins back. You gonna be like that? Bosco! Maybe if I stand really close to him, he'll glitch. He'll be like, stop standing so close to me. Bosco, man! Is that gonna free you up? Bosco. It's the gun. It's the gun. Bosco, I know you're gonna freak out when I come here. I just want to take that gun. I know you don't like it. I know you're waiting for someone to come and get rid of it. Right? It's usually guns. Guns are usually what make them freak out. Look, I'm getting rid of all the guns, man. You can live happy. Who's that? Look, Bosco, I don't know if there's another gun there, but that guy needs to sod off. Get rid of all the guns for you, Bosco. I 
I need that other guy not to see me. Don't tell Bosco. Don't tell Bosco. Oh my god. Why did you have to tell Bosco? Oh my god, now Bosco knows. Okay, get rid of all the guns. You! You ruined it all! Is that every gun? Bosco, I got rid of the guns! Look, guys. I'm just trying to clean the setup for Bosco. Chill out. Oh, oh my God! What is? Uh, need some help here. What the hell? Right, I need another outfit. One that's not tainted in Bosco's eyes. Uh, <clears throat> Look, I know I'm trespassing. I'm doing this for Bosco. He wants to finish his film. And I'm not going to be the one to let him down. Bosco, have you found another gun? Look, Bosco, I'll deal with it, but... If I pick up this gun, you're gonna get pissy at me. Unless you don't see me do it. You okay, Bosco? There shouldn't be more than one gun there. Bosco, you alright? Good man? Do you want a coin? Hmm? I got rid of the gun. What more do you want, man? You want me to get rid of the body? I'll do it. I know, it's terrible. Bosco. Uh huh? One step closer. Did I accidentally leave a bullet out there? Bosco, chill out, man. Chill out. These civilians are really causing me problems. I 
I refuse to start again. I believe Bosco will finish the film. <clears throat> I believe in him. Despite various setbacks, I think he'll do it. As long as I don't kill his manager, I might have killed his manager. But as long as I don't, as long as I didn't, then we should be good. What's going on, guys? Okay, he's calmed down. Come on, Bosco, you can do it. I believe in you. Everyone else is freaked out, but you can be the glue that holds this together. <clears throat> uh huh, uh huh. Don't freak out on those stairs. You've already seen that body. You should be used to it by now. Uh-huh. Oh. Bosco, man. I know you're going to get over it. You got over it last time. It's just a corpse. You've seen it many times. You can do it. I believe in you. Oh. Hey, do you want a coin? Oh my God. Yeah, you go get the coin. Make Bosco snap out of it. Bosco! Stop thrusting at midair, man. I should have left one security guard alive. It was foolish of me not to. Just one. So that he had someone to run and cry to. Okay, this suit's mega compromised. Bosco man, just get over that corpse. Maybe I need to give him his space. Like, look, Bosco. I'll leave you alone. You just do your own thing. I'm gonna have to choke him out and uh, kill him with an explosion, I guess. Bit of a shame, because I already poisoned his drink. Waste of a good poison. That's what that is. <clears throat> Bosco, you got 10 seconds to move, or you're dying. To gas explosion. 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Well, you had fair warning, man. You had fair warning. <laughs> you are one sick man. Put that body down. Don't mind me. Come on, you can all join your hero in death. I hope this doesn't crash the game. It may very well do. <clears throat> This is his manager, I think. Flying ice cream. No way. What? Hey! I need help. Someone, I need help right now. <clears throat> okay. Bosco, you had a good run. That not give me my challenge. <laughs> Assassinate Bosco with a gas lamp explosion. I mean, call me crazy, but that's what I just did. That is what I just did, right?
Fine. We'll do it. Welcome to... Properly. Uh, at least boss goes back in action. Let's do it right. If a job's worth doing, it's worth half-assing and then deciding half-assing doesn't work and doing it right. Can't believe I'd kill such a good actor. I know, I know. Come on! Right, I just need one of those uh, stage crew outfits. In fact, maybe I don't even need that, to be honest. I wonder how you're supposed to trigger that going off. <clears throat> I'm just going to shoot it twice, but I wonder how you're supposed to do it. Because you have this for the lights, but that doesn't really do anything, except piss that guy off. But when gas comes out, there needs to be something to light it, right? Let's go get a wrench. Be a wrench kicking around here somewhere. We've got a while until Bosco decides to go and do the Q and A, so it's fine. There should be a wrench here. El Rancho. No. Where did I see a wrench? Sorry, Chef, you can't come through. Fine. At least he's calling me a chef, not a chef. <clears throat> yeah, it's fine, I'll just shoot it twice. There we go, he's gonna do his QA, you can tell because he's sitting down. We'll save just before he does it. And then we can get two for one. Maybe. Hopefully. Possibly.
Come on, Bosco. Yoink. I'll take that. <clears throat> Good. You need help. Where you going, Dino? Yeah, let's see. Your skin does have this sallow tint to it. Look, don't insult Dino Bosco's skin. Don't you vomit in a trash can, man. Excellent. Now we've only got one thing to do, I think. Kill him with a fibre wire. That's it. Just kill him with a fibre wire. Easy. Welcome to... Oh, Bosco, I'm coming for you. What, what the hell was that? What just happened? Hey, you call that a flame? You can't let those back now. A goddamn back. Let's go. Oh, Dino really let it rip now. Wow! And this go Rip. Rest in peace. <clears throat> Welcome now. to That's everything, right? We're gonna complete it one last time, just so we get the nice little animation of all of our success. Maybe I should plan this out a bit more. I just need to kill him though. Just need to kill him. How hard can it be? <clears throat> it can't be, is the answer.
I mean, look, I'm not going to claim to be the best at Hitman. But I am pretty good! Oh yeah! Explosive, the incinerator. Nice, nice. The Iconator, rather. Not too shabby, if I do say so myself. <clears throat> 69 percent completion. Landslide, what do you have? What even is landslide? Good evening, 47. Your destination is Sapienza, Italy. Your target is Marco Abbiati, a wealthy businessman returning to his hometown to run for mayor. A snake-tongued, right-wing populist with mafia ties and money to burn, Abiati is already comfortably ahead in the polls. However, beneath his silk suits, Abiati is a callous thug and organized crime is certain to follow in his wake. Our client, the renowned bioengineer Silvio Caruso, sees Abiati as a threat, not just to his ancestral town, but the entire country, and he has asked us to dispose of this would-be patrician. I will leave you to prepare. So we're killing a guy for Caruso prior to us killing Caruso. Fair enough. Okay. I know I said 12 hour stream. But I can't let my sleeping pattern get too bad. We're at 11 hours. Sort of. Tomorrow. <laughs> we're gonna finish Sapienza. Tomorrow. We will, for sure, 100%. We've got two nice new missions to do. If I decide to do the author, which arguably I shouldn't, I should save it until we do patient zero. But uh, we'll see. We will see, but for now I'm going to head off and uh, <clears throat> yeah, I'll catch you guys later, adios.